find it interesting that the first thing I see when I come back is Poon Hub is 699 saying I just took a fat ass poop. Which is funny because like you'll you'll go out of your way to say fat ass. Like you'll say ass, but you won't you'll say poop instead of shit. Cause I think I just took a fat ass shit. It hits harder, you know what I mean? I mean, yeah, that's just me personally speaking. I don't know. I don't like saying I mean, I, I, I like to say pee pee poo poo, but I don't like saying poop. I don't know. What do you think, Spider-Man? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's one thing to comment on. <laughs> uh, let me share my screen for you. Uh, here we go. All right. We'll be getting started here. Uh, another minute or two. Like, oh, another minute. You know, gotta, gotta let the stream idle for a bit. Let it warm up. It's getting cold outside, you know? If, the, if we don't let it warm up, and the, it might shut off in the middle of the interstate. You know? But, uh... Alright, I think um, I'll be good to go here uh, in a bit. Got drink on standby. Water, too. Sonic 06. I'm going to be talking my fucking mouth off, man. My tag says fan gaming Christmas. Get the fuck out of here. Now, you know what, though? Because we were talking about this last night, but right before we went live the first time, I can't find Sonic 06 in the the game tag on Twitch. There's the when you type in Sonic the Hedgehog, it gives you the original Genesis game. But I think Sonic the Hedgehog 2006 is either that unlabeled Sonic the Hedgehog that you see on the category or it's just not there. I typed in Sonic 06, I I typed in Sonic 2006, I typed in Sonic Next Gen cuz that was what it was being called when it was like being teased. It's not there. Uh so fucking I I just using the original Sonic the Hedgehog because this game is called Sonic the Hedgehog. I mean, we call it Sonic 06, but that's shorthand. We call it Sonic 06 because it's just called Sonic the Hedgehog otherwise. And it's like, that's confusing, man, because that's just the name of the original game. Yeah, yeah, I typed it in all caps and all that sort of shit. It just didn't, no, it just, uh, it, it didn't fucking work, man. It did not fucking work. All right, I'm gonna, uh, let me switch over to the main feed here. Um, uh, Explorer, let me know if everything looks fine on your end, too. Yeah, sure. Yeah, seems fine. Okay, it looks fine right there. Hey, look how fucking blue that menu is, man. God damn. Ah, uh, otherwise known as yes, I love my saturation. Please give me all the saturation, Papa. Please yeah, it looks like we don't have any audio crackling. Hopefully, we don't have any fucking audio issues like we did last night, man. Because I had to cut that session off into two bits, and I fucking hated that I had to do that. I hate that shit. Yeah, like that's what I'm thinking, Surge and Dragon. Right, like Project 06 has a tag. But not the original. And it's like, I get it. Project 06 is just the much better Sonic 06, and everyone should be playing that game. But man, it's like, talk about folks that just don't, not even Twitch gives a fuck about this game, man. That's crazy. Anyway, we're continuing where we left off in Sonic 06 yesterday. We didn't, I would I would have liked to have finished Sonic's campaign yesterday, right? Because normally it takes me about three hours with cutscenes to do this campaign. Uh, we couldn't do that because of technical difficulties and because I wanted to cut the stream short before the Japanese Final Fantasy Fan Fest uh, last night, which I deeply enjoyed. And I want to talk about that later. Uh, so fun fact, it turns out that despite that 30 minute load screen I had in the beginning of the session, this game is installed in my hard drive. Now, to be fair, quick question. How old's that hard drive? Uh, so you asked me beforehand what model of Xbox that I have. And I, I blanked on it because I didn't remember the actual name for it. I said slim, but that's not correct. It's the Elite model. Uh, and I just didn't remember that it was called the Xbox 360 Elite. It's the Xbox 360 Elite with, like, the matte finish. Because when the Elite originally released, I believe it had, like, a right. shiny sheen on it. Only on the um, disk drive. Only on the disk drive. No, no, because like my my brother Mark got his Xbox 360 Elite before I got mine, and his was a different was a completely different cover on it. It was it was it was shiny, like a PlayStation Three. Right. So, 
It's glossy then. It's glossy. There, there you go. I don't know why I was right. blanking okay. on the word, but it's glossy. So it's glossy. The hard drive isn't on the top of the console. It's inside it. It's... Yes. Okay, so that is a slim revision then. That's Trinity. Yeah. Okey-dokey. So the Elite I have has a matte finish. Yes. M-A-T-T-E. Uh, but I did have this game installed on that Elite, uh, and that, but that was years, years ago. So when we were talk, so when we had that really fucking long load time in the beginning, we're wondering, it's like, oh, is it reading off the disc? You haven't installed on your hard drive? And I said to myself, I'm pretty sure I do, because I remember doing that years ago. So I wanted to make sure after the experiment reminded me, make sure your thing is installed on the hard drive. So I checked to see the options there. And normally it gives you an option. Like when you hit the, when you go to the game menu, it gives you an option to install the hard drive. It didn't show up. So I was like, I think it's already installed. So I checked the network. I checked the settings, the storage settings. And sure enough, the game is there. It's like five gigs. Uh, so I don't know what the fuck was the issue I had yesterday besides 06 moment. Hashtag 06 moment. But this game is already installed on my Xbox. Uh, Nintendo is asking, can you install an SSD into a 360? I don't think you can. Yes. Can you? Difficulty. Yes. Oh, so it's possible. But why is it difficult? There's the... Hard drives are contained in a little custom chassis. You'd have to pop open the chassis and then do I swap it in, then tell the system to format it. Now, if you were to do it via, uh, I don't know, USB, yeah, go nuts. Yeah. You could be limited by USB 2 speeds, but if that's the route you want to go, you can go for it. Okay, I guess so. All right, um, we came back from the future. Oh, we're back in the present. Uh, Radical Train, I think, is the next stage. Uh, so yes. let us do Radical Train. Now, Radical Train, uh, for to give it some credit, is one of my favorite stages in Sonic's campaign because I just like the stage's design. I like the music. Uh, and the mock speed section is not terrible, but it's not good either. Uh, but we do get the bounce bracelet at this time. And the bounce bracelet, I mean, it's a far cry from the bounce bracelet from uh, Sonic Adventure 2, but it is still the best means of Sonic shredding through enemies' health in this game, especially the big guys. Mm. Oh my god. Um, but yeah, I mean, but uh, I hope you guys have been enjoying your Sunday. I mean, I- I'm literally just coming right off of the, the Q&A that I hosted. Uh, just like uh, half an hour ago prior. So thanks again. If you were there for that, I do appreciate your company and for answering, for asking questions uh, and just engaging in conversation. Uh, but we're going to be playing some Radical Train right now uh, for this playthrough. This is my all gold medal Sonic 06 playthrough. It's basically, it's the next one on the uh, up on the docket for uh, my 3D Sonic playthroughs that I've been doing, like all Emblem Sonic Adventure 1, 2, and that sort of shit. I'm trying so fucking hard to get to this rainbow loop and it's just not fucking working but either way that kind of goes into what i was saying earlier so like so like the other playthroughs that i've done so far i'm not really prioritizing getting medals or s ranks now i'm just finishing the campaign first and then we'll start doing cleanup uh after we do all that shit i'm gonna fall off this loop aren't i okay i did not okay that's that that that, that's pretty solid sonic there you go see sometimes you do work sometimes uh, but right now I'm just I'm just focusing on finishing the stage. If I get medals along the way, I get medals along the way, but I'm not prioritizing it. I'm gonna be Mario sunshining this bitch uh, with blue coins and that sort of shit. Again, if you're switching hard drives for 360s, it'll vary by hard drive. But if it's an SSD, it'll only go as fast as what the bus can support. These consoles being 20 years old, mm, it's mm-hmm. not gonna be quite instantaneous. It'll vary from game to game as well. At least what I'm seeing doing an SSD on the PS3 at least. Some games barely affected, some games get improvement. And you have something like GTA 5 on PS3 where it's suddenly like near instantaneous loading. Are there missable side quests? No. You can get everything. If, if, if there are missable side quests, you wouldn't be able to fully get all the medals and that'd be bullshit. I wouldn't hold it against this game. Uh, but to do that, where the fuck is the switch again? Like around here somewhere? Yeah, there you are. Uh, but no, you can do all the town quests are always there. Uh, now, you're ready to shame. do whatever the hell you want. Now, it's a shame this train wreck we call a video game is so CPU constrained, otherwise I would have done an overclock on the PS3 to try and improve it, but <laughs> yeah, I ain't gonna do anything. Uh, how's the sound coming in for you guys, by the way? Can you guys hear the game? Can you guys hear me? The game might be a little low uh, on uh, my end because I didn't want to drown it out uh, too much because I did have a volume problem uh, last night, so... Uh, if I have to tinker with it again later, I'll do that afterwards. Okay, I thought that spring was going to actually send me to progression, but it did not. It sent me backwards, and that is fantastic. All right, then. All right, Gunsong, let's go. By, by the way, uh, just for the occasion, uh, uh, actually, I'll wait until we get to the transition for the mock speed section before I mention this again. But, uh, uh, oh, actually, we're right here. 
Uh, this is the Moxby session. I have brought out the Morbius cup, the fine china with the Long Island iced tea in it. <laughs> uh, do you have an Xbox Series console? And if so, uh, once you get the Sonic Unleashed, will you play on 3C or 3, uh, Series? I will be getting a Series X for Unleashed because I want to experience Unleashed on a system that can actually run the damn thing. The next will play Crisis. Crisis? <laughs> mm-hmm. I'd rather play Baker's system, thank you. Help me, Sonic. <laughs> I don't know, oh, no, dude. No, she's at home painting her nails. The fuck? <laughs> she's at home washing her tights. <laughs> yeah, so okay, this is the end of the section here. We're literally just chasing the train. There's an invincibility box that I just fucking whiffed. <laughs> uh, and uh, you, you just get to the end. We're at the end now. This is fine. You can you don't have to touch the gold ring. You just have to touch the boundary box that have the gold ring inside it. You don't have to actually hit the gold ring. If you go past the train, uh, you'll also uh, count as uh, finishing the stage. That is 13th. Uh, I think that actually that might be an S rank. A. That's an A. No, that's, a. that's an S. The S, the S rank threshold is 50,000. Yeah, smashed it. Okay, no problem there. S A. That sounds racist. But it's okay. I'm Hispanic. <laughs> Whoa, if what the hell? By that logic, <laughs> I can very easily get this stream fucking new. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, hold on a second. Fuck, I just introduced that S rank emote, and folks are already mirroring that shit. Is that like a channel points park? Can you do that with channel points? Is that how, is that how it works? If people are actually using channel points in this channel, you think I do channel points stuff? <laughs> I really yeah, should. I hate that we have to say like the whole fucking term for it. <laughs> what, channel points? It there's no shortening that. No, what? Oh, because of CP, right? Yeah. <laughs> like, there's absolutely no shortening Listen, man, that. do you know how I feel whenever I'm crafting in Final Fantasy XIV and my crafting points are short turned to CP? <laughs> it's like, fuck me, man. <laughs> CP used to be innocent. <laughs> now folks use it as short, short term for really, really fucking disgusting shit. Oh, Silver. Hasn't even been 30 seconds. My pants like we just got here. Like, shouldn't it be going after the train instead of chasing me? He was like, but I thought you were in the train. And spoiler warning, he is in the train because like Shadow also has radical. He's also chasing down the train and your radical train. And we'll find out that Eggman is inside the train. The caucasity of this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> hey, how's it going for a waifu? Why did he love poke? that dub so he much? Fucking like he it's not even a matter of introducing himself as Shadow the Hedgehog. He poses in everything for that. And it was like he just came out of that. He just came out of the 2005 game. It was like, I need this, okay? I just dealt with a fucking alien invasion and I lost all of my gats. Those black creatures. They took my gun permit, Sonic. They took nice. my gun permit. Nice crunchy skybox there, by the way. Yeah. Although, for all intents and purposes, I'm like, I'm, I'm being seriously genuine here. Shadow the Hedgehog is the best part, of, is the best thing about Sonic 06. I'm talking as a character and his story. The game, no, fuck Shadow. I actually hate Shadow. He's my, he's my least favorite campaign in the game. But in terms yeah, of just well, the, because you got a button mash. Yeah. <laughs> no, because I just find him really fucking boring. Story wise, though, Shadow is awesome. I think. The no nonsense, I, I have a mission and I'm going to do it approach works really well for the character. And I think he has like some of the best moments in the game. So can, uh, can we just talk about something here? Yeah. What's up? She was surprised that Sonic saved her. Yeah. So she just straight up tried to commit no, suicide. No, there. see, that's, <laughs> see, that's bad direction, because the only reason why she hopped off is because she caught Sonic running towards the, the, the vehicle. She saw yeah, Sonic but, running towards the vehicle and say, okay, I'm going to fall back. He's going to catch me. But then she reacts it's like, Sonic, I was like, were you expecting him not to catch you with that right? reaction? It's like, what did you think was going to happen? And why did you react like that? Yeah. Were you hoping for like a fucking Gwen Stacy scenario? <laughs> <laughs> My back. Well, this boss exists. Oh, yeah. So this is the egg Genesis and the way they want you to fight this boss. Actually, I can demonstrate. I'm going to show the intended method and then I'm going to show you the actual method by the actual method. I mean, 
we're actually gonna just beat them real quick. Say, are you, are you gonna yeah, we're gonna do we're this? gonna do the actual. So this is how you're supposed to do. You're supposed to wait for enemies to spawn, then you homing attack chain them up to the wing, uh, then you get to the head, and then using your new bounce bracelet, you get to the top, and you bounce bracelet, and there you go. That is how you're supposed to fight the Egg Genesis. But because Sonic 06 is what it is, uh, there is a much more reliable and faster way of beating the Egg Genesis, which we will demonstrate as soon as he uh, descends again, because he can't do it right now. You have to wait until he descends. Although I'm pretty sure there is a way to get up there without having to do like all this shit. You can also just homing attack the bottom of the core, just like that. That's it. That's all you gotta do. Stupid. You can, you can just homing attack the bottom of the core, uh, and then Sonic will act like as if you're on the top of the head and you just lather and repeat, and that's it. And if you Easiest why that's most, uh, and I think I know why that's likely the case. Well, go right ahead. They didn't disable the hitbox for Sonic Story because it's used in Silvers. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. Yeah, this no, boss has. So you, you do fight this boss again as Silver, and Silver's weak point. Well, the weak point for Silver's boss is in the bottom, the the, the orange glowing light. They did not disable it for Sonic, so he can homing attack that bitch. Now, normally you could just, I don't know, duplicate the model, maybe have a scene set up for the collision files. Yeah. Nah, it's too nah, much fucking. Just the fuck we, we, like, we, we only fucking, we, we only got the game goals goal tomorrow. <laughs> Look, it's the Sonic Team method. You start mm -hmm. a base, then you copy and paste. Mm -hmm. All right, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but other than that, though, this, lit this is literally just running in circles until he comes back down, then homing attack the core. That's it. Assuming you don't yep. get like assuming you don't eat shit from a laser, right? This is like actually I'm up the road right now. Oh, my God. It's actually not working. Come on down, what the fuck? Oh, my God. The game is noticing that I'm making fun of it. Oh, I got to back up a bit. Don't I think you're close. I'm too close. OK, there we go. See, look, see, look at that. See, man, karma is a bitch, man. I start talking shit and I get hit. All right. So uh, what are we going to do now then? Because I still think I'm beating this boss a lot faster than what was intended. Uh, or that, or my probably just—I just probably lost the S rank right there. Actually, now I'm thinking about it. But we're gonna run around for a little bit. I'm gonna wait for him to come back down. All right, I'm not gonna I be too have far. A chance now. Yeah. There, oh no, well, it's not fucking working, dude. What's going on? Maybe there we go. There we go. All right, we're we're fine. We're fine. We're uh, I love how to speed this bit up as well. Oh yeah. So here's the thing. So uh, as a shout out to like Sonic Adventure One, the boss has like a desperation attack. It's like, watch out, he's up to something. Uh, the boss is going to attempt to ram into you. This is like the easiest fucking thing to dodge. So all you gotta do is literally hold left, and, you, and I think he won't touch you. Uh, but even if you had like zero rings, um, the boss won't have enough time to actually kill you. The game will immediately cut to the result screen. Yeah, you as long partially... as it hits the ground. Yeah. Yeah. So naturally, you can speed that up by just standing directly underneath it. Yeah, that's all you gotta do. Yeah. I think I lost the fucking S rank, dude. Rank. Oh my god, yep. I got the A rank because I did not. I was not able to cheese the boss fast enough because of that bullshit that I dealt with earlier, man. I don't deserve to call myself a Sonic 06, man. Oh man, we get to play this again. Oh wait, why is it oh, called no. the Egg Mega Drive now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I had it set to the wrong region. Or would it be Egg Drive? <laughs> Also, I think that's the only time in the game that uh, Eggman references like his old E one hundred two models. Okay, you notice the egg Genesis yeah. head looks like a looks like Gamma or looks like uh, Omega, I guess. Yeah, um, I, I absolutely like. I, I'm so disappointed in the fourteen fan base. Why? What's up? Where's my Where's all my female Hrothgar fan art? You're not looking hard enough. I was yes, say, I am looking. I don't. I don't think you are looking hard enough because that is all my fucking timeline is. You know, you need to well, start looking. Jason, I think Twitter might not be the right place to look, my friend. Are you on Tumblr? Tumblr, no. Instagram. You should be on Tumblr, Instagram. Uh, Blue Sky. Blue Sky. Yeah, but yeah, actually, uh, unironically, Blue Sky. Um, Reddit. Hey, we actually got embeds now on there. Um, uh, I'm, I'm just telling you right now. I'm not saying that you're. I'm not saying skill issue, but you're not looking hard enough because I have seen plenty of Fem Harothgar since last <laughs> night's announcement. And if you're desperate, desperate for affinity and weasel. I cannot fucking wait for Pictomancer though, dude. Like when I saw the full trailer last night and I saw Pictomancer, I saw Crowd doing a little Pictomancer thing. Like, oh my god, I was so fucking excited. Man. I want to draw a drone in the Pictomancer gear. That sounds fun. Yeah, but you, you failed the raid because you couldn't you couldn't make your summon because you suck at drawing hands. Wait. <laughs> there was a there was a quick comic I saw. It was like the Pictomancer is learning a new ability. What'd you learn? I, I learned how to draw hands. And then it summons a hand, it was like, oh neat. And then the hand just immediately fucking slams into the ground. <laughs> <laughs> because it's a DPS attack, of course. What do you think was going to happen? Oh, it's just, I, okay, I finally draw on the hand. Let's go. Wait, why does it have six fingers instead of five? <laughs> I am glad, though, that I share the same fucking brain cell 
as like a million other people on Twitter because the so immediately after Pictomancer was revealed, they had like the in game Pictomancer trailer and it shows you doodling on that sort of thing. I, I, I immediately I immediately said to myself and Alex, my friend Alex is visiting my house for the weekend and we play 14 together. We raid in 14 together. Uh, she's a really good friend of mine. Uh, I said to her, I, the first thing I'm going to the first thing I want to see is I want to see someone mod that so that it, you draw dick butt. <laughs> uh, and then lo and behold i load up twitter i load up reddit and a lot of other folks thought the same shit i was like i love yep. when we're like in synergy with each other because that is great <laughs> oh you remember um you remember sfx magic in four in uh, nine right yeah yeah what about it so would that be like the Pictomancer equivalent of being an AI bro? <laughs> yeah, you it don't doesn't do anything yourself. Just, yeah, it just and it also doesn't do magic. anything. It's ineffective as shit. It's just for show. <laughs> I, and I hate what you're showing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Oh boy, uh, this is Tropical Jungle. This is um, this is actually one of my favorite stages in terms of level design for Sonic. It's un unfortunately it's it's handicapped by being on the least level, so our kit is neutered. Uh, we have the shield available, thankfully, but sometimes the shield just doesn't work, and sometimes that you know, happens. No, you just ran faster than the, oh, the shield collision. <laughs> that's right. That is exactly what happens. So if I slow down a bit as Sonic, then I can uh, I, I can able to uh, hit them uh, fine. But if I'm going too fast, I can't hurt them, and that's fucked up, man. Like what a fucked up day for Sonic and company. Going too fast yeah. is a detriment in terms of just batting away enemies <laughs> in terms of regular ass collision <laughs> detection <laughs> so did we ever get an answer as to why i s went so fucking fast in white acropolis that led to me uh smacking the rock and flipping through the wall mm, because i've nope. never had that happen for me before in sonic 06 where i actually went <sighs> fast Like, the only thing I can think of is that I accidentally triggered some sort of, like, speed multiplier. Why in the fuck is the light speed dash not working, man? Yeah. But it's like, I've never, I've never said, I should have had a fart soundboard on the damn thing when you said that. Um, I never had that thing happen to me in White Acropolis, and it was so jarring. It's like, I'm going fast in 06, man. Well, OG 06. I want to stress OG 06, because now we're so far removed from the game's original release, because this game came out in 2006, right? And that is, uh, this year, it will be, 18. what, 18 years. Oh, my God. This game is turning 20 in two years. Uh, it's the been 18 years. turns 20 this year. It's been eight. Wait, 360? No, I thought 360 came out in uh, 2005. Nah, it's 20 this year. Same with the bloody... What was Wait, it? are you sure? I thought 360 came out in 2005. I could have sworn that 360 came out in 05. Because that was the whole point in, of Sonic 06 coming out. I know, out, it was like, 2005. Me, yeah, yeah, yeah. Me. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just a simple mistake. So what am I thinking? What am I thinking? 2004? Hmm. 2005 would have been like, what, the Wii? 2005? No, no we were 2006. 2004 the Wii. No, no, no. 2006? No, no the, the Wii was 2006. Same okay. year as the PlayStation 3. The okay. DS is 2004. Yes. So, as it, the, DS so is the, is come, the DS is turning 20 this year. Yeah, and so's the PSP. What the fuck? Right? <laughs> <laughs> the DS is turning 20 this year. Oh, I should. What are you doing? <laughs> Get on the tree. Okay. 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 Sorry. I had a little bit of a scare there. Me. Why did I jump on the damn vine? Where did you come from? And the PlayStation 2 Slim turns 20 this year. The... Oh, so I don't like the Slim. I'm not sure if I'm the minority on that one. The PlayStation 2 Slim? I don't give a fuck about. I think it's... Uh, I, think it's, I, I, think it's I think it's objectively worse in every sense than the original Fat model. I mean, I it mean, is. Under the hood. It fails constantly, but... Because <laughs> I had, like, three of them. <laughs> Okay, so what was it? Was it the laser assembly ribbon cable getting snacked on itself? Was it the power supply dying? Yeah. You know, what's your favorite? The laser person? assembly each time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and my parents did not have like the the fucking 
capacity to think maybe we should take it to a repair yeah. shop <laughs> no let's just buy a whole ass another console yeah it's fine oh so here's here, here's another question because i know it's like this is this is fucked up man i know we i said this in the previous stream before but i gotta stress again so the sonic 06 is the first game to introduce the s rank to sonic games right so that's why we got the new s emote and we can't rely on a as like the capstone it's like hey you did it so to make up for that because i really do like that a emote that again a uh, spider knife made for me rob uh, he's a good friend of mine uh, I really love that emote and I want to still pay respects to it. If I get an A rank, I want you guys to spell ass with the emotes because it is still respecting the A emote, but it's also not the rank I want because the, the ranks we want in this game are S ranks. Yep, because all A ranks are just... Yes. <laughs> Although I will be talking with someone later down the road to commission an E rank emote for Unleashed because that is a great idea and I'm glad it was given. Oh, would even make it look crusty as fuck. Crusty as fuck, and I want the, <laughs> I want the, I want that dude that makes that 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 blooping music, like that fucking juicy as shit blooping music to like make me a rendition of the E rank music from Unleashed. But it's oh, like wait, it's all you bloops. know what you need. What's that? And these have like JPEG artifacts on it and everything. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Just make it as ugly as fuck. <laughs> no, dude. No, 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 no. I got, I got. I got maybe this one upset. It is the E rank, but it has the PNG checkerboards in the back. <laughs> it's like you couldn't oh even god. properly fucking crop that shit. <laughs> you are a monster. <laughs> now let's get back on the uh, PS2 slim because I know someone was asking. Yes, the CPU is slightly faster. By slightly, I mean five megahertz tops and that's only from the second slim onwards not launch slim launch slim is basically the last fat model shrunk down it has the same compatibility every slim onwards the ps1 cpu is gone just replaced by a yeah it's gone they stopped producing the ps1 cpu so can't use it in the ps2 anymore so they replaced it with a custom chip called deckard it's power pc based because sony was in bed with ibm at the time okay and all that does is emulates the ps1 cpu that's its entire purpose. That's it? Why not just just keep making the PS1 CPU? Now, as it's a cheaper. result of that, I, I guess some so, PS, yeah. as a result of that, some PS2 games will run slightly better, like maybe by a fraction. The problem is your compatibility for PS1 and some PS2 games take a massive hit. Damn, that's fucked up. Just because it's reliant on that PS1 CPU, because it's well, the I/O manager. You have to craft it. dedicated images for every single PS2 game I, I hate to, to dictate. Beat it. I hate to be a dead horse, man. I know like, this is like this is a point that we all bring up as like analysts or just Sonic the Hedgehog fans, but like a big catalyst as to why Iblis gets released from Elise is that she can't cry. Uh, and Matt's it's asking like, if he can enjoy the could you can you could you could you have found a different way to like write around that? Because I listen, I know it's a, I know it's a, I know it's a universe where Sonic the Hedgehog exists, right? He's a blue fucking hedgehog that runs the supersonic speeds. But even then, I cannot believe that a, 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 you, a someone cries, like someone doesn't cry for like 10 years just because they don't want, just because their dad told them to. You know what I mean? Like if she knew ahead of time that if you cry, <laughs> it releases a demon, I'd get that. But at the same time, what would you do if you have dry eyes? It was like, have you never sprained your ankle? Have you ever gotten a boo boo or have anything like that? Have you ever like yawned so much you just? Have you ever? Yeah, yeah, like, have you ever laughed so hard that you emitted tears from your face? It's like I don't, I don't. <laughs> like, it's like, listen, I know at the end of the day, it doesn't fucking matter, right? But. I think it just would have been an easier workaround if there was a different catalyst for releasing Iblis. The fact that she can't cry? Come on, man. Like, I, I don't fucking say, believe that. I don't know, maybe it's like a fatality or something. Or spill blood. There you go. Easy solution. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Get a cut. Get a major cut. Boom, out it comes. Mm -hmm. You get your heart ripped out? Maybe. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but, yeah, but like, all that cutscene really makes me think of is like... I'm staring into Portal my soul. Final Fantasy, <laughs> especially like Final Fantasy X. <laughs> <laughs> so you're gonna get a crap. The only way you're stopping that is if your dad was a sick fucker and took out your ear duct surgically. <laughs> well, that, that and if he did that, also, your dad's an asshole. <laughs> that cutscene also just makes me think of fucking. Oh. 
<laughs> yeah, right as you start up that bloody soundboard <laughs> thing, oh, thing I'm playing, just went, yeah, yeah, man. I forgot that we control God tells in this one, so we have to do this uh, thing with. There's a lady waiting here. Uh, we have to we have to do wave ocean again. Uh, actually, if I, wave wave ocean ocean if I recall correctly, yeah, we have to we have to. No, that's that's shadow you're thinking of. Um, so yeah, we no. so wave ocean or wave ocean. We have to do wave ocean again. Um, and this is this is a, this is very redundant because we've already had tails in a wave ocean section, and at some point we're going to just redo the tails wave ocean section again. That's it. Yeah, uh, and no, but it's like no, because like we 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 start in an earlier section with tails and wave ocean, right? Uh, and that is in itself unique, sure. But then we're also just going to, off the top of my head, if I remember correctly, we're also just going to do the tail section of Wave Ocean again. So it's like... Copy, place, gameplay. Uh, what are we doing? Like, that is something I have to ask myself whenever I'm doing one of these streams, right? Uh, but no, no, give kudos to Tails. Tails understands that those loops don't, aren't real. So he doesn't buy, he doesn't use them at all. Like, he just bypasses it completely. Also, I just remembered that Tails also has different ranks, so I do have to, like, sp ten, uh, spend some time uh, wiping up enemies. Uh, that sort of thing. So, yeah. there, because Amy Pallant used this exact same voice for one of the Pokemon movies. What do you mean? Oh, Amy. Wait. Well, who is Amy Pallant in um, the Pokemon? Um, movies? Tails is uh, Shaman in Shaman? the Giratina movie. Oh, see, that's so after I stop. That's after I stop. That's after I stop watching. Yeah, that's fair. Don't blame you. It's okay. It wasn't a good movie. Nah, after the previous one, bit weak. Like, Shaman was a fucking bitch the whole goddamn time. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus oh Christ. God, it's so vitriolic. Oh, but do tell. No, like, like, actually. Like, yeah, like yeah. Yeah. why? They why, why so, so fucking obnoxious. They <laughs> nag every little step of the way. And then they get bodied immediately. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. Sure, sure. Yeah, and then Shaman is just like, I gotta get to the fire patch now. But Garretina is like, I'm the fucking devil, bitch. <laughs> I think we should worry about other things. I just thought, of, can you? Could, oh my god, you actually follow Tails' movement? I never knew that. Whoa, where did you guys come from? Hold on a second. Wait a minute. Personal space here, guys. Um, chat, don't. Just don't. What? Do what? What are they doing? I'm pairing Sh uh, Shaman or Keldeo as like a worst legendary protagonist. Oh. oh. See, the problem is, Keldeo is also the obnoxious. Here's the thing. <laughs> when I think of Keldeo from the anime, I get reminded of Silver from this game in all of the worst possibilities. Yeah. Like, even the voice direction is eerily similar. <laughs> with my head. <laughs> well, that's a shame because I don't think Silver's. I'm I don't think I don't think Silver's direction in this game is terrible. Uh, it's just like I, I don't mind. So okay, let me be more accurate. I don't mind Silver's voice in this game. Um, but the direction the is terrible. Sucks. The direction is terrible. But that could be said for every character in this game. Every character's voice comes out awkward because the direction is terrible. Had Silver's yeah. voice actor had proper direction, I have no I, I have no doubt in my mind that he would knock it out of the park. Because I do not mind Silver's voice in this game. But the direction is subpar, very subpar. Even worse than uh, like uh, Heroes or uh, SA Two. Uh, I will say still, this is um, my least favorite characterization of Silver in the entire franchise. Le well, I mean, is that really fair, though? Because it's the first game. So I would say it's like more like they didn't know what they had at the point. You know, they, cause this game is the, I mean, I mean, yeah, I mean, obviously, like objectively, this game sets the foundation. So the, all, they can do nothing but go up at this point. Um, I, I, I love Silver as a character, though. You know, it's funny because, like, I, I talked about... I said in the last session that I wanted to spend some time talking about Silver. Uh, and I ended up not doing that. Uh, yeah, but, but we get it. You like Trunks. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, more like, as, as a character... Yeah, it is very Trunks. I mean, it's always it's it's obviously Trunks-inspired. Uh, if not a complete fucking ripoff. Uh, but Silver was heavily redeemed in not only future games, but the comic line especially. Oh, the like oh, yeah. comic book well, silver is fan fucking tastic. I love silver in Archie and IDW. Uh, and that sort Wasn't of thing. this like the only game he got any characterization? No, mm -hmm. um, silver actually got some pretty decent characterization in Sonic Colors DS. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. He was in DS. Well, everybody was in Sonic Colors DS. So that's not yeah, thing, that's something really shocking to uh, say. That sort of thing. 
Um, there's already a couple of people in this chat though, so uh, uh, Matt, next time uh, you can you can be in the next stream next time. I don't I don't I don't want I don't want, I don't want the Twitch stream uh, too crowded because I'm gonna be drinking and I don't want too much noise in my ears. <laughs> You've wasted so much of my time. <laughs> I, uh, okay, you I can just... tell me no. It's cool. Yeah, here's the thing though, Matt. I don't want to come off as a dick. That's the thing. That's that's the, that's the that's my one fear of anything that I do involving either associates or friends, especially you, Matt, because I know you for so long. I don't want to come off Five as a dick. Minutes. But at the same time, time, I gotta keep things in control of what I do. You know, this is SGB stream. Matt's like, yeah, get the fuck in here. I don't give a fuck. Uh, but it's like I was like, it's like no, it's like this is. It's not a it's not a dick thing to tell you no. But at the same time, it's about what I feel. I'm glad that you're telling me this, though, to verify, and that it's not as bad as I think it is. But at the same time, though, I gotta. Uh, I'm I gotta get alpha male gamer. I'm gonna. <laughs> God, yeah, this so entire like lately. scene is so fucking hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're talking about Eggman talking to Elise? Yes, in the the Snap Cube dub, it's so fucking funny. <laughs> <laughs> Look around you, imagine dragons. <laughs> it remains dormant you know, I still have not watched the Snack Cube dub of uh, Sonic 06. Neither have I. I've only yeah. seen tidbits here and there. The only Snap Cube dub I've watched of, of Sonic Tough is SA2. That's it. I did not watch. Did they do Shadow? How many times are you going to keep trying to escape before you give up? <laughs> Five times. Brief pause. The caucasity of this bitch. <laughs> 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 Why in three? This just okay. So, so they good. did. Uh, they did do Shadow the Hedgehog. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I've not seen the. I've not. I've not watched the Shadow the Hedgehog one. I've not watched Sonic 06, But I've seen so many snippets from the 06 fan dub. Um, Shadow, it's me, <laughs> the devil. This is my game. I'm your biggest fan. <laughs> I, the chairs are tilted. <laughs> All the chairs are full of pace because I get tilted at the towers or some other shit like that. <laughs> As they say in Nippon. <laughs> <laughs> Can you play that clip? Actually, I really like that clip. I'm getting this silver medal now. It's, it's right in my fucking face. Uh, so I mean, here we it, go. No, don't point to me in the direction of the bishop. I know where the bishop's at. I think I do. That's a fucking lie. I don't know where the bishop's at. Oh, glory me. This is where we start getting the gems. Uh, and we're going to buy the gems now. Because uh, yeah, So the first way. three gems that are available to us is the green gem, the red gem, and the blue gem. The green gem uh, gives us this really fucking worthless uh, whirlwind attack, which I don't like, even in Project it's 06. Move. Uh, red gem is legit. One of, is low-key one of my favorites because it slows down time. Uh, and because Sonic's meter is busted in the original release, you can just slow down time indefinitely and makes things a lot easier in just terms in terms of combat. The blue gem, not a fan. Mid. It gives you a boost. It gives you a boost button. It gives you a boost dash. I don't like it because while I can move faster, uh, Sonic's control is already very unwieldy in this game, and I don't think it can hurt enemies. Well, it, it switches you to like mock speed mode where you just go on a straight line immediately yeah and you just eat shit and, although to be fair yeah. when you run into stuff and like to be fair like when you run into a wall and boost like you don't take damage yeah but you're wasting time y yeah yeah you are wasting time it's not good like the point is is it's not yeah. good it's just not good uh, so, so, since you requested welcome to tilted towers allow me to introduce myself my name is Memphis, Tennessee, and I am part lizard. Nice to meet you, as they say in Nippon. <laughs> There's only two gems I care about in Sonic Story, and that's the Cyan yeah, and see, Purple Look at ones. this shit. Like, you're going to talk about how overly, because some folks ask me, what do you mean by when Sonic is like overly precise control? So I want you to pay attention to what Sonic's moving here right now, right? Because we have all the time in the world. This is solely on a force. This is the least, this is my, this is the worst fucking hub world in the game. It's um, fuck all, yeah. it's but it's also like, so Sonic can snap in any direction on a dime just by tilting the analog stick in one direction. There is no weight to Sonic's movements in this game at all. So you're running in a straight line. You can hold right. You hard turn right. That is 
terrible for Sonic in a kind of game like this. Unlike in, say, Sonic Adventure or Sonic Adventure 2, where because there was weight to your movement, there was a little more oomph to his movement. And because of you had that added weight, you had a better sense of what you could do and what you could not do. And that was imperative to having good control, which this game does not do well. There's also just no reaction to any sort of terrain. Sonic moves just as fast on an incline than he does on a flat plane of the land. And that, I know, like, it, it doesn't sound like much, but I tell you, as a Sonic fan, that is everything in a 3D platform. Everything. Anyway, so this is the three trials uh, for Sonic's campaign. We have to do this in order to get to the next stage, which is Kingdom Valley. The first is the Trial of Knowledge. I think this is, like, where we have to find the warp panels or some other shit. Wally is doing that. Experiment. I need some clarification on something. What's up? Um, so whenever you, like, eject a disc... Uh, on the PS3, while a game is running, mm -hmm. uh, does the game shut down as like a system command of like the PS3, or is that a line of code that's in the game itself? I think it's embedded into the hypervisor. Okay, well, why is this game an exception? I don't Old remember SDK this. Revisions. I want to okay, say okay, it's this. Off, no, not this one. Then you have to it's remember this one. in early, early PS3 games, they didn't have a full OS yet. They just had a very skeletal one. But normally when you pop a disc out of a PS3, it sends a little command to the hypervisor to go, okay, uh, current code has stopped running, physical media has been ejected. Um, we go back to, what was it? Uh, VA search or the visual <laughs> shell <laughs> shorthand. Uh, hold on, I want to all... memorize this. And then I'm going to start over just so that I can get the S rank and not have to do this again. Is the only other part that would have a, any roles so in discs would be uh, Megacom, one. Right. Yeah. which controls uh, the disc drive. It is this one. That one. And then it is either that one or the this left one. one. The left one. I, I feel it's the left one. I feel it's nope. Damn it. I, I should have went with my instinct. I, I believe uh, it was the right one. Yeah. All right, so the, the right one behind one, one it's right behind you. then it's the one next to two. Why do I remember this? <laughs> uh, because you're pathetic and just like me. Uh, so uh, then it's this one. Then it is this one. Let's see. Nope. Nope. Okay. Wait, so no, it, it was so the one behind, behind you. you. This like, one. Directly behind you when you spawn. Yeah. This one. Then it's this one. Then it's this one. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to quit the mission. Yeah. Then we're going to do that again. Because <laughs> I, like, I, I do not. Gotcha. I do not want to do this again. So we're going to S rank this immediately. That's so like I don't normally do this for other town missions because again we're going to have a whole session of like town missions and cleanup for Soliana. But this right now we S rank because I do not want to fucking do this again because these trials are. Beep, beep, boop, boop. But, They're just um, not fucking fun, man. They're just not fucking fun. With what I was saying about like the, the fucking PS3, for whatever reason, you can just eject the disc and the game will keep going. <laughs> oh, Animal Crossing. Uh, like, because the uh, music will stop, but everything else is fine. The only reason I can um, think it might work is because it's cached on the hard drive. I guess. Because that is something you could do with early PS3 games is you could cache to the drive. The problem is Sony was a bit stingy on it back then. So the max you could do was, I think, four gig tops. Which is why you have to I'm install so and reinstall Metal Gear Solid 4 between each chapters because it has to get rid of the old cache to put the new one in. But then they gave you the option to just install all of it, didn't they? Yeah, but that's up to the developers. That wasn't a OS wide function. What are you doing? What are you doing? What? This one? No, this one doesn't Okay, we're going to start over again. So, at the very least, quitting the mission is not the same as starting a mission over. You don't lose a life. But, uh, the, the fourth one, you, it's, the, it's literally right behind you. Literally right behind me from the angle that I'm loaded in? I don't trust the yes. game to be consistent with that. Yes, it, that it is. Okay, more accurately, I don't trust myself to remember that it's always consistent with that. Uh, you just have to remember that as soon as you go through that, you're in the air. Whatever, uh, you. 
I know I just joined, but I think I might hop off. My head is starting to get to me. Starting oh, to get, get wait, to starting to what? Starting to get to me. You're like, getting head? You're get no, it, no. <laughs> no, I think I'm, yeah, I'm a little bit of a headache, so I'll probably just go Have you ever gotten tonight. blown on a Twitch? Uh, it's not this one. It's this one, right? All right. So. <laughs> Nope, it's not that right. one. That, that wasn't the one. That, that wasn't was the one I think. I don't know why it's number four. That fucking trips me up. So here they go. I'm gonna turn the camera around, right? And I'm gonna do this, and then I'm going to do this, yeah. right? Then you said the one right behind me. It's not that one. That's, that's the one I came to discover from, isn't it? Isn't it? Right? Right? That's right? the one you just went through. Okay, so it's not the one. That's you not the one the behind me, though. The top one, right here. This one, right? Here? Right? Here? This one. This one. This one. This one. This one. Nope, it's not that one. Not that one at all. Not the one. I don't trust. No, I've, that's been too much time. That's not. That's not the S rank, dude. Not the S rank. The, the S rank's fucked. It's gone. It's gone. I had it and it's gone. So it's not the one that I had directly behind me. That's so. Is that what I'm understanding? Is that what's going on right now? It is. Be working directly behind you. Just I don't, don't no, snap I the think, camera. I think that, no. I have to because I tur I did. I I did a 180 and I hit the L trigger, which is the snap camera. Don't snap. And the then camera. I turn around. And then I saw it, and then it wasn't the one that took me there. So I think you're getting you might, disoriented. I think no, so I'm not getting disoriented. Are you telling me, me, who's already down like ten ounces of Long Island? Not even ten ounces. I'm saying like sixteen ounces. Sixteen ounces of Long Island from a Morbius cup. Are you telling me that I'm disoriented? I don't well, believe yes. this. I mean, you're drinking from a cup from the greatest movie of all time. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm disoriented. I think you're disoriented. And I think we should have a Morbius too. <laughs> Wait, all right. So right for right behind me, right? You talking about that one? Yes. You win this round. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there's a running entity. Thank you very much for the raid party, you too. I hope you were enjoying whatever it is you were playing. What were you playing uh, out of curiosity? If you're still here, I don't know. Sometimes like when I raid someone, I immediately dip. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? That wasn't fast enough. That wasn't fast enough. What? I fucking straight shot that shit, dude. Oh my God. I got to do that well, again. Sit there. <laughs> oh my God. What are you talking about? I went right through every portal right then and there, dude. Nope. Fu <laughs> well, <laughs> they don't lie. Fucking fucking. I should have slowed down time, man. Not I should have used the red gem. All right. Uh, what's next? It's at the. Oh, no, this is the combat trial, if I recall correctly. Yeah, the test mm, of courage. Yes. So this one is just you're you're fighting a bunch of goons with no rings. Uh, so normally I like to do this with the red gem because when the red gem, everything slows down, including enemies. So that makes them free for the picking. Although given me that I'm streaming, we have streamer luck. I'm also a little inebriated, if I'm being honest. Uh, I am probably going to fuck this up. Because I have had times where a miniature bomb from one of the spider goons just fucked me over. And there's nothing I yep. can do about that. Or your homing attack misses and you just get gunned down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Vulcan cannon shots won't hurt me individually, but they'll kill me. Oh, the, the little fucking electric bombs. Fuck! Like that. Why did you like say that. something? Why did you jinx me? You're supposed to be the Messiah. I've seen the pictures. You glow so so phenomenally, and you fucking said you you jinxed me. That's fucked up, man. That's fucked up. <laughs> I thought you were my friend. <laughs> It, it literally happens to everyone <laughs> on every playthrough. I fucking hate it. No, that's not true. You can watch the SGB playthrough where I don't fall for that. Although I probably could have edited that. You don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Actually, because that playthrough was so long ago. And I don't remember what I did or did not do in that game. <sighs> I, I'm pretty sure I cut that out back in my... <laughs> <laughs> no, I like I tried to streamline that place. How do you redo just... missions anyway? You can redo town missions from the menu, RS Ray. Why the fuck I call you RS Ray? I know your name is Ray. I could call you Ray. Also, where the fuck is my red gem? Thank you. You look I'm looking at the radar most of the time for this. Uh if you find an invisible goon, 
Uh, if that that's likely the leader of the squad, so if you take care of them, you take care of everybody at once. You're looking at the radar most of the time because red dots on the radar are enemies. Uh, oh, this one, you, these guys are above the tree, aren't they? Oh no, they're on the tree. They're on the tree specifically. You Fuck Sonic 06. me! Yes, dude, Sonic 06. Okay, more exactly, my experiences of playing 06 on stream is quite the 06 playthrough of all time. Because I said, like, I think in the first minute or so in the previous session, I was like, oh, it's like, this is like, we're going to be in this for the long run, man, because this is Sonic 06. But I said to my, I said out loud, I think that, no, man, I don't, I don't think I'm going to struggle as much because I like 06 more than Shadow the Hedgehog. I, I think that's, that's not saying anything new. I think people, folks have known that for a long time. I like 06 more than Shadow the Hedgehog. But... I did not account for streamer luck. I did not for account that I am live streaming this playthrough. And so far, I have run into every little problem that 06 has to offer. And I have to preface again. I understand that in the subject of Sonic 06, I am beating a dead horse. I mean, that horse is not even fucking dead anymore, dude. It is dust on the floor. John, I may be drunk. <laughs> um, but at the same time, you know, if I still had the choice, I'd still play this game over Shadow because Shadow bores me to fucking tears, even if it is a perfectly functional and no, that's not a perfectly functional, that's why I hate it for a reason. Uh, it is more than playable. It's just not fucking enjoyable. It is so fucking boring. It's tedious. Yes, it is very tedious. Like, especially if you're not just if you're only doing the neutral route, it's whatever. But as soon as you start getting into all the other routes, trying to get the final story, which you have it, to just, do. it becomes to tedious. Yeah, it, it just it just what the flying fuck are you telling me that Sonic is vulnerable in his ball state? Like, I'd, I'd rather trying to think how to describe it but i would rather play a game that is jank and fun than a game that's tedious it is i don't know it's it's a case-by-case -case basis right because i know some folks have a hard time grasping that when a game is boring it's worse than being bad it's like, what do you mean by that? It's like, why is a game boring worse than a game being bad? If a game is bad, you don't want to keep playing it. And that sort of thing. And I understand that, you know, because Ghosts and Goblins on NES is bad. Bad to the point where I don't want to play it. Like, get it the fuck away from me. Not even, un not even ironically, that game entertains me in any form or fashion. But there are things I really like about 06. Again, I, I and I'm not, you know, like 10, 12 years ago, like you'd be like you'd be put on you'd be you'd be hung at the you burn at the stake if you admitted liking any bit of part of Sonic 06, right? But I said all the way back then, it's like, no man, I think Sonic has very interesting level design. It's just it's just held back by everything else. But when you get used to it, when you're beaten down, when that Stockholm syndrome is in full fucking effect, I can find enjoyment in playing Sonic Story. Not these town missions, because fuck these town missions. But in the game itself, I can find enjoyment of because it's just Sonic Adventure 3. That's all it is. It's just Sonic Adventure 3 with worse controls. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, this is like as formulaic as Sonic kind of gets. Excuse me? Excuse me. You still have Joe. Oh, okay. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. <I'm> <laughs> what a fucking idiot. <laughs> I stubbed my tongue. Well, you know, you don't have rings, so if you stub your toe, yeah, you yeah, yeah. just cardiac arrest. Right I don't on know, dude. This is not so. This test is called the test of courage. What the fuck is courageous about this? This isn't the test of courage. This is the test of stupidity, as in my okay. stupidity that I keep reattempting this shit. At I some point or another, Sonic, you have to call the duck a duck. 
You have to call a spade a spade. Move on. They were, there's plenty of fish in the sea. Also, you know, like, do, do people in Sonic's world just kind of like end up on the news or just randomly dying? And then the autopsy report says, oh, they, they bit their tongue and they didn't have any rings. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, do Sonic characters end up in the news? And I was like, yeah, because Shadow was on the news. And that's how Sonic knew that they were. No, that's how Eggman knew that there was a second hedgehog outside of Sonic. Not just any news, dream news. That's yeah. how you know it's reliable. Wait, what do you mean they folded in 2001? What the fuck? Yeah, they said some really fucking fucked up shit like during the election. And like they shouldn't have said that even if everyone else was thinking it. So it's yeah, like, really, nah, you really shouldn't probably say that. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to cancel the show. Uh, they really had to throw the slander angle at the Xbox. Wasn't the dream, same after the, that. The Dream Network probably would be like cancel Colter strikes again, right? They would be those kind of dickheads that say that kind of shit. And they call Shadow that black hedgehog. I was like, what do they mean by that? We're coming around on election year again, and uh, do you really want to vote again for Mr. President? <laughs> Mr. President, hot here, filmed with this black creature. <laughs> you, you can't just say that. You can't just say it. Why not? <laughs> it's for the people, and I speak for the people. Well, God well, bless uh, America. Well, sir, first of all, that's my wife. <laughs> so rude. Oh my no, god. This Look, listen, I don't, wanna, I don't wanna I don't wanna I don't wanna I don't wanna get too depressing on this thing, right? Because I know you guys come to these Sonic streams for fun or just wanna vibe and veg and that sort of shit. But listen, if you live in America, I am so sorry because this year is going to fucking suck for Americans. Because of politics and that sort of shit. And I am so sorry. Like I <laughs> all I can all I can offer. All I can offer is a form of comfort and escape with these live streams. I'm not I'm not telling you to bury your head in the sand because that is a very irresponsible thing to do. But yeah. I also see the writing on the wall and this year is going to fucking suck. Yeah, especially I mean, if we're complaining about election fraud like in the past, mm -hmm. imagine like the shit with AI and stuff now. Yeah. But anyway. So, Enough like, of that. I know. No more political talk. I know. Uh, I, next I, stream, we're doing MGS2. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My favorite non political series, Metal Gear Solid. But I'm, I'm just saying right now, as an American, for those that live in America, this year is going to fucking suck. And I am so sorry that we're going to have to be dealing with so much insufferable assholes until the fucking sun sets on December 31st. But I will do my best just to give you guys some form of escape with these live streams, my videos, the discord, that sort of shit. And I thank you all for coming by and just like vibing that sort of shit. But let's not mince words. This year is going to fucking suck for Americans. You know, what would be like so fucked up to do. What's that? You do a let's play of MGS2, and then at the very end of the let's play, <laughs> yeah, the the camera feed cuts, and it's just an empty computer, and then you walk in a frame, and it's like, no, I wasn't playing this game. It was AI the whole time. <laughs> oh no, he's writing it down. <laughs> write it down. Write it down. God, I haven't played MGS2 in a long time. Last version I played was the Vita. Well, well, uh, no, I'm leaving you guys. I'm leaving the 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 choice for you guys uh, in Twitch chat. Oh, I'm gonna give about a minute uh, so you guys uh, uh, vote uh, for who I should be choosing <laughs> for the trial of love. We have Amy right here, and we have White Amy, who's right here. Some regions call her Princess Peach. I don't see it. Other, <laughs> other um, regions call her. I don't know. Bottom. She's kind of half and half. Like her, her the upper body says Princess Peach, but the bottom half says Daisy. So I don't like that. So I don't know. <laughs> Upside down, carrot top. <laughs> 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 that got you. 
<laughs> I'm going to tell you what got me specifically. And it's just, again, I have to, I have to confess. I have a few drinks in me. I'm so sorry. But you said Carrot Top. And I immediately, like I, I like said, like if Princess Elise was like 10 years older, right? She probably have like a big fucking bush as big as Carrot Top's hair. I'm just... <laughs> I'm so sorry. Wait, hold on. What the fuck? How do I delete what someone else just said? I said if she was 10 years older, fucking pay attention to what I'm saying, goddammit. <laughs> anyway, we're picking Amy, not white Amy. There we go. <laughs> right. Why even need to say anything? <laughs> <laughs> Probably not. Why? Why <laughs> is it this year alone <laughs> that I've had two streams in a week where we get canceled for saying drunk things alongside? <laughs> Wait, hold on. Wait, what's the other stream? Because I this is the first time I've gotten like somewhat inebriated, like on a God, Twitch stream. New Year's Sonic Shuffle stream. The no oh, wait, where was that at? Where was that at? Where was that at? What are you talking posted about? Posted a clip of it in the server a few days ago. Who was hosting that? Someone uh, I mean, pretty much everyone was hosting it. Honestly, was it in the sub Discord? No, um, huh. it was just it wasn't in sub Discord. It was a couple of buddies. Uh, I'll give you the the link to it later. I don't think I want to. <laughs> but like, <laughs> but, uh, me and Jason have to suffer this. You do too. Like, let's just say it got so bad, I had to manually DC him from the call. And it oh, was his Lord. server. Dude, you know you fucked up if someone manually disconnects you from a call. And it's his server. Like, I understand. Some, it's like, like, sometimes you guys say some pretty fucking cringy shit, myself included. I want to make sure that everyone's assured on that, myself included. But I never had to manually disconnect someone from a Discord because of stupid shit they said from their mouth. You know, I mean, I'm glad it hasn't gotten to that point. But you know, you fucked up if someone had to manually DC from the Discord. <laughs> like Jesus Christ. So, what's going on? And it wasn't me. No, Emily. Like Emily, you're you're you you have a very blunt and barbed sort of sense of humor. But I understand that you're joking and you also don't cross that many lines. <laughs> that was the one who got put in horny jail. <laughs> in jail, for me, it's a revolving door. We don't have time. Let's get to Bird! Fuck! <laughs> All right, this is the, um, the fucking demo area. Yeah, yeah, yep. this is, um, this is what you play in the fucking demo. There we go, I'm gonna ride this bird. Look this is this fucking build. Oh, yeah, demo as well. Which is also a more recent build of the game, uh, as opposed yeah, to uh, which is fucking, fucking stupid. Yeah. Um, so yeah, fun fact. So the demo you play at this game, they I I don't think you can download anymore, right? It's available. Is it still available? Uh, the you demo you can the demo you can download this game lets you play Kingdom Bite the stage here specifically, and it's a it it is a it is a future version of the game. It's a future. It's a it's a it's a more recent build than the final product. For the the final product they gave us is a older build that was that was like ready to go more than the build they had ready to go for the demo. That is fucked up, dude. Like this game, I I wish this game had another year or another no, two years. Anniversary. I had no idea you can grab this bird. Where is this bird taking me? What do you me? mean? Where did you? You can always grab that one. I I never grabbed that bird personally. That eagle. Because normally when I'm in that when normally when I'm in that previous section, I do that homing attack chain that lets me that leads me to the rope to take the upper path. I never take that I eagle. I did not have sexual relations with that <laughs> bud. <laughs> but I did wear their underwear. What the fuck? That, that's more JFK than Clinton. Yeah. The only the only eagle Clinton. the only eagle that I ride is the one that takes you to the second act, or the one in the beginning that takes you to like the hidden one up. Like this eagle I ride. That's a one up over there. I've never seen that before. One second. I'm gonna go get that one up. No! <laughs> Why didn't I fucking bounce off of the capsule? What up, Will Smith? Are you fucking kidding me? 
one up. More like one up yours. Fuck. Dude! <laughs> also, look at this. The Havoc engine at work. <laughs> look at these physics. <laughs> Look at that shit physicking on the floor. <laughs> Boy, that's, the, that's the most physics I've ever seen. Physics I've ever seen. Physics. Hit the fucking light speed dash, Sonic. God damn. Hit the gritty. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I installed the gritty on my 14 uh, server. Fuck. Okay, there we go. Pissing lives away, man. I only got fucking 18. How did I. <sighs> Wait, hold on. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That light speed trail is supposed to help you get that silver medal. I just went well, fucking past that shit, dude. Anyway, <laughs> we're going to just move on, man. We're going to just move on. Fuck it. No, I mean, that's, I mean, that, I mean, I want to say that's borderline an 06 moment. I don't know. That's truly an 06 moment because I don't want to like, I don't want every, every, I don't want every moment of fuckery to be an 06 moment. 06 moments have to be specifically sure. when the game just shits the bed. And it's not just from me stumbling because I played this game too many times. That's kind of the gag with me in this game. But I'm I, I am not a professional 06 player, whatever that means. So if I fuck up something, that's not an 06 moment. That's just skill issue moment for John. Uh, sorry. Actually, no, I'm not sorry. Everybody burps. Everybody farts. Don't too. You do not have your upgrades yet. I, yeah, you're right. Because <laughs> oh, I saw you trying. Yeah, to I tried to do the. Belts. I tried to do the shockwave. You're right. You're right. You're right. He fucking <laughs> called me out, and he's absolutely fucking right. I can't. I have no retort for that. He's absolutely right. What the fucking shit, dude? I love the spot. That is an 06 moment. <laughs> <laughs> Why did it spawn a frame Jesus after you threw Christ. Right, You know what? Hold on. Like, hold on. Let's, let's 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 move to let's move to the other channel, uh, Twitch stream. Let's get Matt. If you want to come by, come by. By I don't go fuck anymore. Come on. There's there's more room here now. I don't go fuck. Come on. Oh, uh, let me just let me get a oh, wait, shit, 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 shit. I gotta I gotta I gotta uh, I gotta share my screen again. One second. There we go. All right, there we go. Alright, that's updated. Where the fuck? Wait. Hold on. Where'd the enemies go? Don't worry about it. Hold on, wait a minute. Where the fuck did the... I can't fly with these because as soon as I hover, I'm going to drop the items. Alright. Um, I, I need some advice. What's up? I'm not leaving the room to grab drinks. I'm just grabbing what I have in here. Okay. Uh, so what should I do? I got a crown apple whiskey. Okay. I've got a blackberry moonshine. Right, right, right. And I have Tennessee honey whiskey. Um. So, all right. So, out of those two specifically. Also, I hear my voice again. Matt, are you listening to the stream? Turn the stream off. Hear my voice again. Are you <laughs> Seven puns. You said it twice. Uh, watch the uh, Discord stream on the uh, the the, the Discord bat. Um, out of those choices that you've given, Jason, I'd say the honey whiskey, because honey whiskey fucks. I, I'm speaking <laughs> as someone that doesn't like whiskey that much. Uh, but a honey whiskey I can have in small doses. Then, do you yeah, hold on? For me, I <laughs> you don't want to help? All right, fine. I can do this. I don't need you. 
I do not need you, yeah, Silver. What the, how the fuck did you do that? Don't, you I, I don't need you. There's an invisible wall! Oh my god! No, I like, what the fuck? No, I can how hear you, Matt. You? I can hear you. I'm just processing this game. Are you fucking kidding me? I can just... Hold on. Hold on a second. Wait a minute. I didn't know that... How far can I go before... I don't have the purple gem. Uh, because normally when I'm doing this, I have the purple gem and I can just ignore all this. But there's an invisible wall here. Unless there's another part where I'm not... Hold on. What if I get this hint? Okay. It's still a silver hit. Or right, hold on, can I clip through a wall? I feel like I can clip through a wall if I like try, right? Because this game is built on shoestrings and nope. Well, here here's a, a minor spoiler for when you come back to this level. Lay it on me. You can skip this entire level as silver. I no doubt. Campaign. Well, isn't that the case with every silver level though? Uh, well, you you hop on the water. Wait, wait, wait! I got it! I got it! I got it! I got it! What if I were to like? Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Fuck. No, wait. Shit. Okay, I'm sorry. I got massive brain worms right now, guys. I'm so sorry. But I got massive brain worms because now I want to see if I can do this. Why? Why is that suddenly not working? Normally, just that getting just a, so small. Just approaching book. silver is enough to trigger switching to silver. Hold on. I'm so sorry for this, but I want to. I want to try this out. I want to try this out. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and box launch off of this one specifically so that I can get up to like above the invisible wall. Assuming it doesn't stretch up infinitely. If it doesn't, I can't do anything about that, and I'm sorry about that. Uh, but I want to see if I can I, I want to see if I can O six over this wall. Then you go to the moon, or worst case. Sorry. Sorry, Matt. Uh, your mic fucked up and you ruined the punchline. I didn't know what you said. I think the boxes respawn. Yeah, the boxes do respawn at the very least. Um, hold on. I want to see. There's got to be a way that I can. Yeah, there we go. 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 We're cooking with gas. Cooking with gas. Cooking with gas. Cooking with gas. So I go infinitely, right? And then I will, was... I will jump up <laughs> and then land where Silver's level ends. I was very confused by that. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. One. Nothing wrong with me. <laughs> Two. Nothing wrong with me. Three. Nothing wrong with me. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> let the bodies hit the floor. <laughs> let the bodies hit the floor. All right, here we go. 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 I swear to God. Here we go. Here we go. If we can do this, I'm such a fucking gamer. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. No, okay, okay, we can't make that obviously. You are. I can't see where I am though, dude. All right, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, but I want to see if this actually works. No, why did I jump off the eagle prematurely? Why did I do that? Oh my god! The gamer equivalent of hold my beer or watch this. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. We're good, we're gonna do this. Again. We're gonna do this again. hogs a year suffer from premature <laughs> eagle ejection. <laughs> With just two dollars a month, you can help support Fuck. and stop this cause. Spawn the box Donate again, please. Today. I would really appreciate it if you spawn the what box you? again. Can you. What do you like, Boxing Moon Foundation? Spawn the box again. I said Remember, fucking thank spawn you, the box again. Thank you. I appreciate that. All right. So you're going to the moon again? I'm going to try and go to the moon again because I want to see if I can actually land where Silver's level ends as Sonic. If I do this right, Sonic will meet Sonic. Unfortunately, it's pretty precise on where I have to spin. Well, click a uh, kick in order for the box to rise. There we go. There we go. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now here we go, baby. Here we go. Here we go, baby. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Fucking. You know exactly what I'm thinking of. You say not as high. No, I think we have to go higher. Because the higher we are, the more we're going to fall to go forward. Because here's the thing. We're only allowed one homing attack dash in midair. So we need to go as high as possible. 
and then adjust as soon as we see the terrain. I think we're fine. Oh no, I died! <laughs> Fuck! Yeah, there is a kill plane the, there. There is a kill plane on the outside! Okay, I, I've learned something new. I'm so sorry, guys, by the way. Again, I said beforehand that this is going to be a normal playthrough until we finish it, and then we're going to do gold medal <laughs> cleanup afterwards. But what the fuck does that actually mean when it's the subject matter of this game? You know what I mean? No, Sonic, we're not going on a magic carpet ride. Okay, there we go. Um, I'm going to wait for the box to respawn, and then I am going to... Who's coming down to judge me? It's <laughs> if you're gonna come downstairs to mock me with the horse mask, at least know where you're fucking going. You almost ate shit. <laughs> Here we go, There's buddy. Only one roll of toilet paper upstairs. What? Only one. We should get a bidet. I'm so oh, absolutely. They are. They are. Oh, you they, know what? Actually, you ever John, wanted to I just blow water you. up your ass? Fuck oh, yeah! Hold up, hold up. Uh, I, I don't actually. <laughs> Only when I'm showering. Yeah. yeah. This is Alex, by the way, guys. This is what I was talking about. This is my friend Alex. We 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 raid Final Fantasy fourteen together, and she's one of the, she's one of the best machinists I know. Hello. Hi there. Uh, Hi. but uh, yeah. Wait, are you still having the horse mask on? Do you like my Crocs? I like you. I have the same. Wait, hold on a second. What? Fucking. Are they? Oh, oh this is a thing. Oh, Jesus Christ, he is drunk. <laughs> Hi! Hey, Alex. <laughs> Hi. Hi! I can't hear you. Hi. You stop, oh, man. Give me crack twins. I need a fuck. I need a new fucking headset. I don't want to, like, give them, like, for free for Twitch, but, like, the feet. Oh, like... <laughs> I can't, like, show them the money makers, you know? <laughs> <laughs> What's the money maker? You hide your Yeah, I'm embarrassed. Then what the fuck you think I am? Uh, uh, braver. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> wait, here we go, Twitch. Oh wait, sorry. You okay you. there, Matt? What the fuck? <laughs> okay, but okay. <laughs> no, I think we're fucking fighting. Wow. Can I well, how? Uh, I think we're you Sonic Croc fighting. Okay, Croc I need to check. I have Shadow the Hedgehog on mine, okay, so I yeah. win. I'm just making Huzzah! sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I have a one liter whiskey, whiskey bottle here, Holy and it's shit, empty. Like Am I drunk right now? <laughs> Holy shit, he is drunk. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Like, Holy hell. He's blasted. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, no, this bottle has been empty for like a week. I am not drunk. This is actually happening. Okay, I'm gonna have to go and get myself tested. <laughs> so this man, believe you me, he's still good to go. He's still got some more gas in the tank before he's fully drunk. Well, we'll know when that happens, when he's, um, flat ass on the ground, drunk. Alright. What happened? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Alright. Anyway, what was that? <laughs> anyway, uh, check general. Oh, wait, I wanna- I wanna take to the moon first. Uh, get to the center of the box. The absolute center of the box. Yeah. Oh no. No, I don't think I don't think I'm at the actual center of the box. This box may not have. Is this the same box? Yeah, it's the same box. Uh, kick it first. <laughs> to like activate it. Yeah, there's no collision on this box. There's what? no physics. There's no physics on this box. Okay, now now there is. Now there is. There now you there is. Go. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Sorry, hold on. What the second. fuck? <laughs> Alright, hold on a second. This game is so great. I'm trying to. Dude, I'm just. What the fuck is that noise I'm hearing? Is That's that Matt's mic? mic? That's Matt's mic. Yeah, that's Matt's mic. Matt, uh, <laughs> yeah, fucking yeah, exit, yeah. exit the call, see if your mic settings are like, and then come back in. No, he, he's gone. Oh, he's gone. Okay, never mind. What the fuck, dude? Even when I'm trying to fucking break the game, it won't let me break the game. Oh, wow. Am I going to clear it now? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you now, Matt. Much better, though? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can hear you. All right, because some No, no, no! Whoops. Uh-uh. Wait, hold on. I know someone's asking me, is like, 
just play the fucking station normally. And I was like, no. No. <laughs> Alcohol has already been imbibed. Now we're going to do what the fuck. Dude. We're at the mercy of the dungeon master. What the fuck's going on, Which, dude? Like, why is it uh, not? You know, it <laughs> why is the box suddenly not boxing? <laughs> it's funny you mentioned Actually, the, the box is boxing. <laughs> what well, was that, the Jason? Problem is the bell hasn't rung yet. <laughs> it's, uh, it's funny you mentioned a bidet because uh, the fucking LTT store just added a bidet to their storefront <laughs> from another YouTuber's merch. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't hear no bell. And so you have two options. You have the uh, the standard basic bitch bidet for fifty I, bucks. I, I I am going to give one more college attempt with this, and then if not, then we're just gonna play the stage normally. Oh my god, I have I have never I have never never struggled Neville. this hard with the box glitch in 06. Like if this was in Soliana City, I'd be up to Jupiter by now. Is it Noctua colored? No. But the uh, the other bidet, which is it's it's heated, so there's uh there you get Ooh. your ass stays warm and the water is warm too, uh, so you don't get ice cold water up your asshole. Ooh. <laughs> uh, it's got RGB lighting on it, and it's uh just a small five hundred dollars. What the fuck? I, I just, like how <laughs> there's I like something how funny. Just... There's just something funny about describing as ice cold water going up your asshole. <laughs> <laughs> That's just, what it is. I just heard Jason describe a bidet here like he like it's a prices right up price he won. <laughs> and no shit, you kinda sold me on that, yeah. <laughs> like Dude. if I could get like an RG bidet or something like that Hold where it's on. like it looks like a unicorn blows up in my fucking bathroom after I use it, I'll fucking buy it. Hold on a second. <laughs> Maybe if I just use this box. No, Sonic, no. Again, the only reason why I'm humoring this is because for some reason or another the game is not auto switching me to silver when I get close to him because normally that's all it takes. You just gotta get close enough to silver to switch them to his 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 gameplay section. But for some reason or another, uh, I don't know if it's just because I'm just not approaching close enough to silver. Uh, it's not switching over. So while <laughs> as I'm Sonic, I'm going to do what Sonic does best and just oh my god! <laughs> Ice cold water in your asshole for three easy payments of nine ninety nine. Okay, we're just. Gonna, we're just gonna play so until, until right. I feel the warmth of Nora's front on my warm hand on mine again. I will have to suffice with this by then sho shoving cold water up my ass. But Joe Biden it's... was my favorite president. <laughs> <laughs> Soda! <laughs> Yippee. Remember when Biden fucking went into the debate and said, I'll shove cold water up your ass, and everyone clapped? <laughs> oh right, the uh, the speed run thing for this level. So like, um, because you skip the the fucking bracelet for um getting yeah. the drop bounce thing, mm -hmm. uh, you can just hold the slap while in the air, and as you hold it, you just skip across the water. Like the water just rejects him. Hold so on, can, can I? Just... So can I do that now? Because I don't have that Unfortunately, upgrade. Unfortunately, no. Why not? Uh -huh. Because you need the slap. Yeah, <laughs> I have the slap. It's right here. The, the upgraded slap. Oh, <laughs> there's an upgraded slap. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, like, <laughs> do I get a ring for my ring hand? Like, like what is that? Like, mean? Yes, yes. It's the, the, the pimp slap. And shit. It's a pimp slap. When silver has no time to take any s from them silly bitches. <laughs> At least it's not a pimp shotgun. <laughs> oh, what are you cooking? <laughs> so when you oh, get right. all of Silver's upgrades except for the um, the fucking drop uh, shock thing, and for whatever reason it bugs out his slap in midair to where it gets just weird effects. Uh, one of the effects is that it can cause you to teleport a couple of feet forward, and it makes Silver one of the fastest characters in the game. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> <laughs> and the other glitch is where, like, the water, he just skips across the water. Like I have seen stone. that in speedruns of the game, yeah, but I had no idea how to, it's initiated. So I, I'm definitely, listen, like, I can't wait. Like, there's a part of me that's like, I'm going to drink Dorn Silver's gameplay, too, because I'm going to be doing this shit with Jason you know, like, as my wingman, <laughs> like, telling me how to break the game in two. Uh, so it's like, I, I, I'm very much looking forward to that.
Yeah, Silver people speed run this. So people stupid. speed run any game, no matter what quality it is. All right, like that's yeah. just like that's just like give or take a buck. There is a that's not necessarily a speed run, but you be people do shit with other games. Like there was a video going around about some kid or thing about getting to the actual final level of Tetris. It's like people yeah, pretty- people will do shit with games, no matter how like good bad or in between even if it just seems so in uh, unfeasible people will do shit man you, one of the sad thing is the uk press basically went oh wow that's an amazing achievement go touch grass i'm wow. not even joking I was How, they just said that out loud and it's just excuse me love go touch yeah, it for something anyway, that's never yeah, been I'll achieved before this lady i'll be surprised <laughs> if fucking anything touched your ass <laughs> yeah, seriously. It's like, yeah, seriously. It's too bad nobody's given her an old good old fashioned clam slamming, but you know. <laughs> but, yeah, no, like, yeah you know, right, yeah, at, at Long John Silver's. <laughs> like, I mean, don't give me. I mean, like, I'm all for clowning on that shit too, but it's like, she's 13. That's a hell of an achievement. He broke Tetris. Like, don't that, belittle someone. Just, AI. Like, don't belittle someone for, like, just having a hobby and achieving something in it, all right? Like, fuck off. Like seriously, yeah, and then they praise a child for like playing darts, <laughs> right? <laughs> and no, like, you're wrong. Like playing darts is also a hobby and it's a fun activity. I'm not gonna dunk on a darts player, but it's also but like it's be- like the same go outside. But it's, yeah, it's the thing though. Yeah, yeah no, man. Point. It's like the same people who dunk on people achieving shit in video games to the same people that watch fucking football. And it's like you're watching someone else play a game. You realize that, right? And it's like, come on, man, have some perspective. Like, like, come on. It's like this shit's easy. A fucking first grader understands this shit. Uh, come on, man. Don't be fucking stupid. Stupid people have said that shit. Don't be stupid. Where the fuck the door? Like, there's a door. My mother, I'll be stupid. Wait, like, no, no, you can be stupid, Matt. But it's also like, there's a, there's, 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 there's different degrees of stupid. Yeah, and you're, just and don't get me stupid. wrong, you're stupid. Thank but you're you. not that kind of stupid. Good of me. I have more faith in you than you. <laughs> <laughs> there's like onion. There's like layers of stupid, like yeah. an onion, but if onions were stupid. I I, don't, I need more drink, dude. Because I thought Matt said funyun for a second. I was like, yeah, there are different layers to a funyun. I was like, no, there's not. There's only one fucking funyun. What the fuck are you talking about? Get loose. Get stupid. <laughs> Uh, I think we've already achieved that. What, Funyun? Oh, let's go with that. Yeah. <laughs> no, uh, also, experiment, I'm so sorry. <laughs> we have already achieved the original version of let's get it started. Uh, <laughs> like, I know what you're referencing <laughs> and I hate it. <laughs> I can't believe they thought that song was a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> like, it was a sign of the times. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. There's a fucking metal that just ran past, dude. So you wouldn't know by the stream so far, but this is an all gold medals run of this. Oh, my fucking God. It's an all gold medals run, and you're currently taking home I'm the crap. Just like. I'm I'm just doing regular fucking things that I normally do in any other Sonic 06 playthrough. And I've played this game a lot. I mean, it's it's, it's not even a gag at this point. Now it's just sad of how many times I've played Sonic's campaign in this game. But there are just things that I do normally. Dude, what the, the fucking silver medal well, is right in right front now, of me. And I still well, haven't grabbed that son of a bitch. We're not really going for the gold medals right now, chat. We're just going for the participation award. Yeah, we're going <laughs> for the participation. I know how to spell my name. And even now, I'll fuck that up. I'll spell my name as J-A-U-N. And I fucking hate that shit because some things that I use will spell my name like that. You know, shout outs to Uber drivers that pronounce my name as Jaoon. And I was like, that is just wrong. Because clearly the U is in front of the A there, and you pronounce it as if the A is in front of the U. You wouldn't pronounce Matt as Matt. You wouldn't pronounce Jason as Jossan. Yes, son. <laughs> no, but I've heard someone fucking pronounce it as Jason before, and I'm like, what? No. <laughs> yeah. Not in public, I hope. <laughs> I was going to say, this pillow talk is weird. (laughs) (laughs) I'm just like, what the fuck? 
Wait, they try Just to say it's like some Native American shit. I'm like, no, no, Dude, it's not. Shut oh the fuck god. up. Oh my god. People fuck up my name, but it's literally two letters. How hard is AJ? <laughs> I think with enough drinks, I probably would pronounce the name as Edge. How many of you used to mis misread our name as experimental? <laughs> I want to see hands, because I know it's a lot of you after this. I remember five years ago. How many lives did you have when you started this age? Uh, it was in the higher teens, I want to say, like 18. I'm not sure, actually. Like, legit, I don't know. I think it was like 24 or something like that. Something of the sort? Yeah, then I got too experimental. Sorry, experiment. <laughs> uh, it it never course. fucking ends. Let's just be a PSA to all you boys and girls. Never trick at Sonic. I don't know. Yeah, man. Sometimes I have. Otherwise, I, I'll I DC you from the call. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah. It really depends because sometimes, um, and I, I, I'm so myself included. I was like, I'm, I'm not. I don't want to like cast too many stones in this glass house that I live in, but like, I don't know, man. Sonic fans say some really fucking stupid shit under the influence. Uh, myself included, which is why I'm trying to be very careful, like with what I, what comes out of my mouth, because I, oh my yeah. fucking god! Uh, so yeah, don't toss that cut. stone, toss a frag grenade instead. Yeah, toss like yeah, I'll ta I'll toss a frag grenade instead. Hey, Vanilla Rabbit, thank you not very much for the raid party of one. I do appreciate that, and I'm very very sorry. <laughs> Speaking of frag grenades, yeah, what about? Uh, it? Did you see the the thing in the the news about the the guy suing Dunkin' Donuts for what specifically? For the toilet exploding, huh? Well, yeah, they should have just got a bidet, exploding. dipshit. <laughs> like, put a cherry bomb in there or something? Yeah, I was gonna say, I was like, listen, like I have some sort of responses to Dunkin' Donuts food too, but not to the point of exploding a fucking toilet. Like, damn. So they use this thing called a flush mate, which is like a high pressurized pump to make sure that everything uh, flushes in one go. Right, right. Oh, oh so and is it one it of those? Explodes. Is it one of those? <laughs> all right, so I think I might know what that is. So, like, is that one of those flushers where you think you yourself are going to be sucked into it because of how forceful it is? Yes. Yeah, okay, so I know exactly what this is. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, it, maybe it's deserved. <laughs> because sometimes, like, you know, you know what has it? Movie theaters have, movies have, theaters have these too. Uh, I'm trying to grab this silver metal. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. I'm just trying to grab the silver metal, and the silver metal is not working with me because I can barely see that son of a bitch, and I, I, I my depth percent. Okay, there we go. We're fine. We can find. We can finally pay attention. Anyway, what was I talking about? Ray, I was talking about flushing the toilet. Uh, there are times where I'll flush a toilet in like a public eatery or a movie theater, and that shit just. Wah! I was like, fuck me. And it's like, I, I, if I looked any deeper, I would be sent to the fourth dimension where I belong. Sorry, was that a toilet flushing or a cat hissing at me? I mean, it is. It's a cat hissing. <laughs> yeah, no, like the, 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 the toilet literally exploded. Not water <laughs> like, rushing up. It just... Boom. <laughs> <laughs> like a bomb going off. <laughs> Oh, but day! I thought you meant oh, doom. <laughs> Did I get oh, that medal? Those bidets are so delicious. <laughs> <laughs> God, that show sucks. <laughs> well, I'm stretched now. Oh no! <laughs> Jumping is, is jumping is very dangerous to the box piece sections of this game. I want to be sure because you cannot change your direction in midair. Is this the uh, original 06 or is this Project 06? This is 06. No, this is original 06. If it were playing Project uh, 06, I would not be disrespecting as much as I am right now. <laughs> what what show? Uh, live action Cowboy Bebop. Oh. Oh my god. I'm all for shows taking civil liberties, and when it comes to live action, there's to be expected a certain amount of change you're going to have to go through, but making Jet stupid to the point of eating urinal case was not one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, my time bonus is zero. <laughs> Again, that's deserved. I think that might be my first C. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, like as much as uh, folks, I want I want to emphasize, I fucked around so much in that stage. Like this stream is an hour and a half long, and I'm pretty sure 34 of those minutes was me fucking with that box. 
like in the beginning of the game and I still the beginning of the stage and I still got a fucking C rank. I didn't even get the worst rank. The worst rank in this game is D. You get the uh, pizza after this. I actually ordered pizza myself today for uh, lunch for dinner because I have that really bad habit of if I have a sink full of dirty dishes, I clean all the dishes and it's like, I don't want to make another fucking mess. So I order out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, man, because that you can easily fall into a fucking rabbit hole with that mentality. I was like, yeah, I, I know. Yeah, and I woke I up too late. I'll order out. It's like, but you order out the last five days, John. I was like, yeah, but what's number six? <laughs> yeah, but you just gained 10 pounds this yeah. month, John. Pizza? Are you guys turtles? No, no, no. Nah, just... fucking man. I gained 10 pounds. It's more pushing for the cushion. More cushion for the pushing. What the fuck did I just say? That was a sentence. I don't think it was construed with words. I don't think. No, I got my words reversed there, though. I said more pushing for the cushion. I was like, what the fuck? I don't fuck cushions. Oh, we don't know. That. Oh, no. He's, he's humping the cushions again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, gonna have to change the stuffing again. Oh yeah, suddenly Blaze. <laughs> no, I was like, oh! Just suddenly Blaze. <laughs> yeah, Blaze is just suddenly you. <laughs> I guess you just, like, you, uh, just, you have to play Silver Story and understand the significance behind it. This significance is not actually anything. She's just here. Oh, I know that character. They're from Sonic Rush. Uh, what are they doing here? So, <laughs> Oh, you sweet summer child. What's up, Matt? <laughs> if, the plot if the plot to avoid Armageddon involves... Making sure Elise doesn't cry. Wouldn't you be doing the world a favor by putting two in her brain right now and calling it a night? She's only 16, dude. Like, I'm not going to. Point like, taken. Uh, but at the same I mean, we were talking about it earlier. Again, I think it just, it would have been better. It would have been less of a headache if you're written around a different catalyst for releasing Iblis from Elise. Because you cannot, yeah, I know. If, if you cannot cry at all. If you do, you'll release the demon. And it's like. What are you telling me? I was like, when, when, when was Iblis placed in her body? She was only like what six years old, I think, and that sort of and? thing. And she, you're telling me a child that young, up until the age of sixteen, has not cried once in her life? I don't fucking believe that, man. And yeah, listen, I know. let's like, I know it's like it's a Sonic the Hedgehog game. Don't think too hard about it. It's like, no, man, that's really fucking stupid. Like right? that's a really—it's like, it's, <laughs> it's Granny's Peach. It's like Granny's Peach Tea from uh, Batman v Superman. Go right the fuck back to the drawing board, writing board, and give me a second draft. What the fuck was that? <laughs> she gets sand in her eye, and then <laughs> ah! Iblis. You can like it cuts to Iblis inside of her. Finally, yeah. <laughs> I can be free. And then Elise is like, "No, no, no, that doesn't count. <laughs> My eyes are just sweating." Yeah, and it's like, "Fuck." <laughs> what do you mean sweating? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Darren, thank you for the bits. Hey, John, how's it going? I just cleared P10S in 14. Man, what a fight. Oh, that's a spider. Fuck that spider. I hate pandemonium. Oh, no, but congrats, though. I'm, I'm glad you uh, got your clear. That's good. Uh, I think P11 is easier, but P12 is fucking dull as shit. Uh, so, well, anyway, I, I wish you the best of luck. Where the fuck am I going? Right, I gotta talk to the girl, and she'll what if tell Elise, me. What if Elise got trapped in a room with somebody who ripped a really eggy fart? And she can't get out of it. And then she's and then like, the yeah, man, it's like, what, 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 what if she got fucking caught in some tear gas because of like a protester rally or some other shit? And she starts crying. The and then it's like, yeah, what if terrorists attacked or some other shit? And she starts crying. What if she watched the movie that was really fucking sad? And she starts crying because she relates to the characters. It's like, what the fuck? Dude, there are so many ways this can go south without her being locked in like a sensory deprivation tank. So it's like, Sir. dude, like just just write a different catalyst for the for Satan literally being released from her body because the so here's the thing like the idea of a princess containing the deep like a, a spirit of Satan or something like thing is pretty fucking hardcore like Sonic or otherwise but the catalyst of it being released is her crying come on man that's just listen I understand what I'm saying this in a Sonic the Hedgehog franchise that shit's unrealistic <laughs> like I just don't believe the fact that a girl can withhold from crying something as simple as crying for a whole ass decade or so anyway we're going to we're going to aquatic base well no the the, the funnier part about it is that you know the the whole thing about this game is you know don't cry right 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 oh, or, or like, the, the world will end <laughs> meanwhile literally in the same breath of this game's development they have another game 
Sonic and the Secret Rings, which ends with, here's a, a mountain of handkerchiefs, so, so you can cry anytime you want. I wish for a mountain of handkerchiefs. I like so the way that Jason worked. Endlessly wank. I like the way Jason worded that too. He's like, the main thing in this game is don't cry. It's like, ah, oh, the central themes of, of Sonic the Hedgehog 06. Don't cry. <laughs> don't cry, <laughs> stupid bitch. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> so we have to we have to ring the three bells of this area of Soliana to unlock the we're at the final stage by the way for Sonic we're almost done um uh, we have to ring the yeah, three bells mule, to unlock that's the even base. funnier so what was that <laughs> uh and now Sonic legally can't cry in the comments oh my god can we talk about <laughs> can we talk about the stick that Sonic Sega has up their ass in regards to what characters can and cannot do in other Sega forms of media, Sega, Sega specifically, because it's Sega you have to thank for why Archie or IDW can't do shit or interesting shit with Sonic or Shadow specifically. Oh my God, they have such a humongous stick up their ass in regards to Shadow the Hedgehog, where there's like, no, there, there's an image, there's a brand to maintain with Shadow the Hedgehog, where he just can't fucking do anything interesting to give him any sort of depth. And it's like, come on, man, I read the comic books so that these characters can be explored in a way that the games don't have time to venture into themselves. But you're telling me, no, nah, man, we got to keep this shit vanilla so that at the end of every issue, every comic, there is a status quo to maintain. There is, uh, I, I just recently caught up with like the last of the Sonic IDW trades, right? Because I legitimately do enjoy my time with the Sonic IDW line. But the last one that I read, I think it was trade number 15 has Eggman's plot with this city that's made of robots that like it instantly regenerates because it like it it's it, it's powered by this fake crystal energy right it has nothing to do with anything that was set up previously but it's also like some of the most milk toast vanilla shit that I've ever read and I was like what happened to all this shit that we were planning beforehand like why is this here this feels like a fucking filler arc uh and normally I hate throwing the f word around filler because I think that's really easy blanket a term to just describe something okay. that you don't like <laughs> But at the same time, nothing fucking happens in this damn arc, except for introducing this one girl. She's a sheep or a cow. I don't know. She has a bell around her neck. I forgot her name. It starts with an L. I, you know, that's a that's a cool character. You know, not not for nothing. I think uh, Lanolin, that, her name is Lanolin. Thank you uh, very much, Rogue Mike. Her name is Lanolin. Don't get me wrong. Lanolin is a cool character. I love the design, everything about that. I think the true purpose of this arc was just to introduce Lanolin as a character for IW, and that's fine. But the arc itself was a big fucking nothing burger, man. And I know a part of it is because of those fucking mandates that Sega has for Sonic the Hedgehog, where he's not allowed to do anything interesting. As much as we dunk and meme on Archie, Sonic for being so fucking ridiculous at times. It was at least allowed to stretch its wings and explore shit, even if it was laughably bad most of the time. But at least yeah. it had the creative freedom to explore those venues. IDW can come off very sanitized at points, and not in a good sanitized mm -hmm. way, but more as if this is just the villain of the week sort of sanitation. I did I not ring all the damn bells. Uh, no. I thought it was like the only time they had fun with, with Sonic as late was like that that literal like two panels that he had amnesia and then got super horny oh on blaze fucking gonna oh level my... with you on this um uh, wait go ahead, Matt, go ahead go ahead go ahead i think it's honestly just i think we're trying to apply chinese calculus to checkbook balancing here ultimately i think the problem is good old-fashioned all japan xenophobia on this one They're, they'll they will allow st changes to the status quo of sonic so long as those status changes of quo come from Sega Institute of Japan. If the second a filthy gaijin American touches this <laughs> shit, fuck you. Your ass is getting neutered to the fucking ground. I could point to Sonic Boom. I could point to Sega Technical Institute. And I'm going to level with you by some... I don't know how the fuck we even have Yakuza games here in America anymore because of them. <laughs> Well, uh, I really just think it's just Sega is really afraid of their contractors killing the brand. But it's, it's no, like, but Sega, you're already doing that yourselves, bud. Dude, 
Fucking Sega is Sonic. Sega Sonic is most popular in North America and Europe. Japan doesn't give a flying fuck about Sonic. So just fucking let America and Europe take fuck take the helm. Like because we do way more interesting shit with Sonic than Japan ever does because we actually give a fuck about this blue rat. <laughs> Like yeah. just hey, oh, oh, hold on, hold on. I'm getting a live. I'm getting a loud message from the land of our from our brothers over the sea. Fuck you! <laughs> it's, like, it's like, come on, man. It's like this shit's easy. Like it's not hard. Uh, and it's like it's really fucking frustrating. You were talking about like that whole soul dimension thing with Blaze at the end of the Metal Virus thing, which already ended very anticlimactically. And I hate the fucking way Metal Virus arc ends in IEW. Yeah. But Without there is a, there is there is a whole. <laughs> two pages or two issues where sonic recovers and he has amnesia for some fucking reason and it's quickly dropped and it's like yeah you but guys, he's like super fun during that time and horny it's like you guys are, you guys are cowards like just let him have fun it's fine it's fine just Your let character. sonic stretch his wings and it'll be fun i like when sonic's fine. i understand there's a status quo that needs to be maintained for the sake of the brand i get it i understand how it works for the sake of keeping things consistent and sellable and profitable but man it is so creatively sterile to the point where i'm Falling a fuck to sleep, and you get the feeling it ain't the writers. It's purely Sega doing it. I, I have no doubt. Like I, I have no doubt that there is a lot of ideas that Ian Flynn and the others like want to explore with Sonic, but it's like Sega of Japan is like, no, you can't do that because this is not on brand. What we have for the idea, I was like, you don't give a fuck about Sonic in the first place. I'm sorry, I don't. I like I take your word with a grain of salt because I don't think anybody in Japan gives a flying fuck about Sonic, dude. Sonic has always always been Sonic's main base has always been in North America and Europe. Those are the fans that actually give a fucking shit about Sonic. I'm not saying that there's no fans in Japan that give a fuck about Sonic, right? No, I'm pretty sure there is. But I think categorically speaking, numerically speaking, the North American and European fan base outweighs the Japanese fan base by a fuck ton. And that is what you have to cater to to ensure Sonic remains healthy in the market and that sort of shit. But they don't do that. Uh, and and as, as I said, because again, good old fashioned xenophobia. They cannot stand the idea of an American developer or branch of three people showing them the fuck up on anything. Oh my god! I really hope that's not the case because I would like to think that. But you know, sometimes I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't want to come off as like overly naive and that sort of shit. But at the same time, sometimes it honest to god does feel like it is just that, and I wish it wasn't. Part of the part of the horror of the adult world. A lot of people have to rectify is that yes the world leaders and the people you looked up to are in fact not only flawed but horrifically fucking childish <laughs> hold on hold on hold on since chat is like asking about it uh here i'm gonna link it to chat and i'll put it in general as well of uh, the uh the, the fucking the page but it's just like sonic giving blaze bedroom eyes <laughs> entire fucking conversation and it's oh, only God. while he has amnesia <laughs> <laughs> the he's Vulcan. just like, <laughs> like what the fuck he's he's down bad <laughs> like, what the fuck? hello 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 Wait, somebody joined? Who joined in? It Stop. is... Wait, hold on. <laughs> hold on, I can't... Jin I can't fucking back. say, Hey, Jen, how's it going? How you doing? I'm good, just finished playing oh, Fortnite. Jen. Fortnite? I'm so sorry. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> no, 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 seriously, I, I hope you do enjoy your time. Like, Jen, I think this is actually the first time you've, uh... You fucking, uh... You, you joined in the stream. Also, Chaos Like, that's rude. Who? What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, it's okay. uh, like, like, Jen is my friend. Uh, we met in 14. Uh, and that sort of thing, and uh, yeah, I invited to this for a while. Like, Fuck you, okay? <laughs> like, 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 you're making fun of me because I have friends. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you play video games about a blue rat. Who says you have the right to have friends? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck man, that, that actually killed me. Uh, <laughs> no, tell Sonic you are right down the hole. <laughs> right, uh, I just want to eat up some pizza. Yeah. Uh, but how, how everything has been, Jen? How are you doing? Like, dude, I'm fucking. I shouldn't have not been drinking while playing this game, dude, because I'm fucking up the simplest shit. 
Uh, this work's been stressful, but, uh, you know, managing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's good to hear at the very least. Uh, all right, but you yeah. play 14. Uh, did you watch the FanFest uh, trailer? Uh, that yes. Sort of thing? What do you think? I am so excited for Pictomancer. You will not believe how <laughs> I, I got on my seat. Yeah. Oh, I'm so ready. <laughs> yeah, I am absolutely ready for it, too. Like, I can't, like, again, I'm hoping that Dawn Trail actually releases, like, late June, early July, and not, like, at the tail end of the summer. Like, <laughs> fucking, what's the last day of summer before autumn, <laughs> like, arrives, and that's technically summer? I'm hoping they don't pull that shit on us. October. Oh, or that's September fucking. Or like, I think September 23rd uh, or 22 or something like Japanese that. Japanese summer? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> like, what the, oh, like what Nintendo did with Smash? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, you know what? I didn't fucking do before ringing the three bells. I didn't go back to the shop to see if I got the Wait, purple gem. What the gem. fuck was that? Uh, so, like, what? What did you do? What? 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 You, you didn't see that? No, oh, what? What is it? What? What did happen? What happened? What happened? You, you tossed the, the ring bomb. At the uh, the the fucking explosive box, uh -huh. and it dinked off and did nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't it like actually explode. You. It just, <laughs> like it actually just moved. <laughs> like yeah, no, it just bounced you're off supposed to detonate. <laughs> I, I hate the ring box in this game so much. Yeah. <laughs> because it doesn't fucking work, dude. It's because it's like, it's like, it's, it's just, oh, there's a silver metal here. Uh, it, you just, it's a dummy ring bomb. And like, it, this is Tails' main method of attack in this game when he had a perfectly functional tail swipe attack in SA1. And as much as I don't like the mech in SA2, uh, it is still a more reliable means of like destroying enemies than it, the ring bombs in this game. And again, yeah. I have to I have to stress again because I'm eating shit right now. If you haven't already played Project 06, just play Project 06. Like it is the Sonic 06 that we should have had in 2006. Like it is such a marked improvement across the board. Really, they even fix the story beats. Yeah, it, well, no, not the story beats. It's just in a, in a pure gameplay sense it is much better in every form or fashion. Although, to be fair, uh, the developer of Project 06, I think it's, what was it, Chaos X? I want to say that's the name that comes off the top of my head. Uh, they are working on boss fights right now and the hub world and story integration. So it might be a few more years before it's fully ready, but the game as is has all the stages available. So if you just care, if you just care about the game itself, you can play Project 06 to full completion. And I oh, have, I and it is so much fucking better than this game in every sense of the word that there is no reason, unless you're a dipshit like me, who streams this game for 100% completion while inebriated to earn money and to keep in contact with this community. There's no reason to play the original game anymore. There's just absolutely well, there was no reason to play the game in the originally in the first place, but <laughs> well, like, but there is no reason at all to play the OG game unless morbid curiosity sets in. What's up? I know you're drunk, but like, why don't you just carpet bomb these guys? What? Because I'm drunk. Fair enough. I forget. I forget. Tails could do that because I when you said carpet bomb, like, what you want him to like freaking? <laughs> no, that's no. Uh, that, oh, that's that, carpet that, dusting. That, no, that's carp. That's crop dusting. Crop dusting. Oh, my fault. My apologies. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I get my fart terminology mixed up all the time. My apologies. <laughs> farts. Yeah. Uh, farts. War crimes during Nam. What's the difference? Yeah, you know, it's like Tails is like in in that fucking like that 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 tier list of characters that if you run into in a bathroom stall, uh, Tails is under the one where he just shits louder if you knock on the stall door, <laughs> uh, just to get you to go away. It's the quietest bathroom too, when nobody's making a sound. Yeah, oh my God. You know, I used to feel some sort of way about that too. Like public, so cause like, a, like, the funniest thing about I have with like sharing public bathroom stories is that folks are kind of caught off guard that I actually take a shit in public stalls. It's like, you actually do that? I was like, yeah, man, if I got to fucking go, I got to fucking go. But even then, like, even when I'm in a public stall, I'm always slow key embarrassed with like I'm taking a shit because if I got a fart and someone's in there, I'm waiting for someone to just laugh after I just blast out of my ass. <laughs> and, it, and it never it never it never happens for the record it never happens so this 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 fear is completely unjustified but nowadays i don't give a fuck you know what really helps when i'm using a public restroom i got headphones on i'm listening to music i'm i'm listening to youtube while i'm evacuating my asshole i can't feel i can't hear my farts 
So I assume nobody else can. And that makes it so much easier to process. I understand this is really gross coming out of my mouth right now, but you also have to understand I'm fucking miserable right now, guys. <laughs> So I have to keep the conversation going with any tangent that I can possibly. Why isn't this fucking door opening, dude? Kill the enemy. Try and ask and get polite. It would be the most awkward ass suicide to <laughs> ever find. I wish we knew anything to help it, but he, God damn it, all he was talking about was farting, and I thought it was funny. I didn't realize the message <laughs> at the time. I'm sorry. You know, but Fart it's also like I used funny. I used to have the most anxiety, like like shitting loudly in a public stall. But at the same time, you have to understand everybody shits. Everybody burps, everybody farts, everybody shits. It's not something to be everybody embarrassed hurts. about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's my favorite fucking Phil Collins song. <laughs> you know, every, like everybody fucking shits. That uh, too. But it's also like, it's not something you really should be embarrassed about. I understand it's a very easy thing to be embarrassed about, but at the same time, you're doing something that everybody does in their life. Shit and fart. <laughs> like, that's about it. Exactly. I mean, there's no, sh yeah, like you got to go, you got to go. I got over that very fast in my line of work when I was, because, you know, you got to go in the field, you got to go. <laughs> it's like, do you understand how many times I let loose in that cherry picker? <laughs> oh, boy, guys, have stories. guys have stories Jesus. about it. Some dudes just pissing, pissing their bucket if they got to. Like, Jesus Christ, just get over it. What are you going to do? Cry? Maybe shit and come? <laughs> come. <laughs> Piss your pants. Yeah. It's, it's awkward when I have to cry a bit in the bathroom and it's so the quiet fuck? that I'm just like, I don't want anyone to hear I never me. had to cry. I never cried in shit before, <laughs> to be fair. Like, that's a new experience. <laughs> like, uh, but that, 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 that's quite interesting. Do I, I do that. I don't cry in the bathroom, but I do have that once a quarter cry in my work truck where it's like, oh god, I'm doing this for a fucking living. <laughs> but, but, I mean, but here's the thing. Like, I honestly got, like, I'm not sure sometimes with these streams, I'm not sure who's just being facetious or actually being a genuine feel, but here's the thing, man. I hope you actually genuinely are not serious about that because I don't give a fuck what you do with your life as long as you're just, like, taking care of yourself. Good. I will Just, never yeah. judge you for any line of work you do. You could be a gigolo for all I fucking care, and I'll still be your friend because I don't go fuck. Hard, but... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> also, what are your rates? <laughs> and are you available on Sundays? <laughs> Not available on Sundays. Not available. On, no, I'm, I'm only available Mondays. Uh, but still, again, like, I, I never, I never cast judgments on anyone and when the line of work on sort of thing because everybody's got, everyone's got to pay the bills, everyone's got to pay the rent, and that sort of thing. I, I understand as long as you're not doing anything like fucking illegal, right? Like that, that sort of thing. Or being an AI bro. Or being an AI bro, right? <laughs> like don't invest in crypto, like <laughs> that, that sort of shit. But yeah, it's also like, say. yeah, I was like, Knuckles, what are you fucking doing, dude? Get on the wall. There you go. Thank <laughs> you. All right, there we go. You can cut knuckles out of this game and lose absolutely nothing. Yeah. Same with tails. Yeah. I mean, same with any character, um, except for Blaze, because we stand Blaze in this in these circles. Best best character in the I game. I will not honestly. hear any Blaze slander uh, in this <laughs> chat. Best character if you in the do. franchise. Yeah, I would say. Oh, okay. Um. Yeah. I mean, I would probably say I'm pretty down bad for Blaze, like all things considered. Same. Uh, because again, uh, like fair. like minute like minute fucking one because she uh, so Blaze the Cat was introduced in Sonic Rush like a year a year before this game was in, uh, brought up. Is it 2005? No, 2004. No, 2005. 2005. 2005. 2005. Um, she debuted in Sonic Rush on the DS and like minute fucking one. As soon as I saw that character design, it was love at first sight. I love everything about Blaze the Cat. Like I love the outfit, I love the purple color, I love the fire powers, everything about Blaze just clicks. Names. Yeah, man, she's a fucking princess that does her fucking job, man. Like she like she like she yeah. works her ass off to make sure that she maintains Strong, stability. Independent woman, a yeah, woman. who don't need no man. Like, yeah, exactly. <laughs> like I get it, man. It's like I love everything about Blaze the Cat. Like there is there is there is a screenshot. Um, I don't remember. What a what a uh, Sparkster! Thank you very much for the raid, party of one. Much appreciated. Uh, IDW to mention that again. There is a shot of Blaze the Cat when she's rendezvousing with Sonic, where she is just t conversing with Sonic on top of a fucking lava puddle, and it is the most raw shit I've ever seen in IDW. And it's like that is exactly what I love about Blaze. She is conversing with Sonic on top of a magma pile because she has fire powers. You know that sort of shit. Uh, was she talking with Sonic or was she talking with Knuckles? I'm not entirely sure about that. But either way, it's still a raw fucking moment for Blaze the Cat. I yeah. love Blaze the Cat, man. And I wish she was in more games. But at the same time, I'm, like, I'm also glad that she's not in more games because that gives more Sonic, that gives more chances for Sonic to fuck her up. 
I, I was about to say, uh, Book of yeah, Boba right? Fett. Yeah, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, the Book of what? <laughs> the Book of Boba Fett. The Book of Bo Oh, you're talking about the Mandalorian spinoff. Okay, okay. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. What, what happened Where with Book of like, yeah, Boba, Boba Fett? Fett and more stuff. Then we get Boba Fett and more stuff. <laughs> uh, maybe I, we shouldn't. It's like, I don't like Boba Fett anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Was the show not good? I have said it time and again. It is the, it, it is the Kane. It is like the WWE Kane phenomena. There are some characters where it turns out the more you learn about them, the less you wanted to know, and yeah. you were better off when you didn't have everything You're, explained. To you. you are absolutely right, and that is my one fear with Blaze being in more games. Don't get me wrong, mm -hmm. but at the same time. It's one of those monkey's paw sort of scenarios where it's like I oh, absolutely. want, absolutely, especially with Sonic Team. Yeah, I was like, I want to see Blaze and Morgan. Dude, when I when I saw her in the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog, and this is an innocuous, free to play fan game that was made with heart and passion. It's a really cool time too. Like, if you have not played the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog, you should. It's a really fun time, especially if you're a hardcore Sonic fan. When I'll take from those. I'll take the word of those fine fellows from Brain Scratch about the game because I enjoyed that playthrough. Yeah, uh, so like when I saw that Blaze was in that game, man, it was like I popped off because like, man, I love seeing Blaze the Cat in games, man. I want to see her and I want to see her in more games because like I really like her in Sonic Rush. I think she's legit one of the best characters in this game specifically. We'll get there when we play Silver. Uh, but at the same time, I understand because, you know, sometimes Sega go to Sega, Sonic Team go to Sonic Team. There is enough opportunity there for her to fuck up because they don't. It's Sonic Team, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like that's it, man. It's like, yeah. But at the mm -hmm. same, like in in the meantime, I will just I will just idolize Blaze the Cat on my downtime. You know what I mean? Like it's yeah. like I I love everything about Blaze the Cat. No, Blaze, how did you get those fire powers? Well, Sonic, it all started when I sacrificed ten toddlers to the <laughs> <laughs> oh, and um, to answer your question, Jen, about Book of Boba Fett, the two mm -hmm. best episodes are the one, uh, he doesn't show up in it at all. It's just a Mandalorian episode. Okay. And the other oh one, he shows up for half of it. And the other half is the Mandalorian. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's gonna that bad. <laughs> I, I think we're going to say one and then stop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, thrust increasing. Hell yeah, let's go. Johnny, ease up on the Blaze fanfic. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I, I should probably just shut up right now. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, since we we're kind of on the, the topic what? of it, though. Um, is this like A Carrier 3? This is A Carrier. Yes, it is, because, yeah, there were technically two A Carriers in Adventure 1. You're right. Uh, what were you saying, Jason? Um what is an instance where there's a character that never really gets expanded upon but they finally did so and it was good uh, this is any media any character or are you talking specifically sonic any media any media okay so if we're keeping it sonic then i would say mighty uh but if we're talking any media a character that did not get enough attention but they finally did and they're much better for it Too bad. Mm hmm I don't know because like when you keep it broad enough for it's everything, I have to think because everything's everything, right? Uh, yeah. So oh, I don't know. I'm gonna have to. I'm probably gonna have to rely on chat on this one because I'm drawing a blank. Oh, I don't have the white gem. Um, I can't cheese this boss. I can't say who, uh, but One Piece. Uh, for the the folks who are keeping up with it currently right now, yeah. I know exactly you know exactly who I'm talking about. To. Oh, okay. Uh, some folks in the chat are mentioning Thanos, like specifically MCU Thanos. And you know what? Yeah, I'll give that to you because Thanos became much more interesting when he was actually a central character in the MCU plot. You know, because beforehand, all we had was like a tease in at the end of the first Avengers movie, right? Uh, and then at the end of Guardians of the Galaxy. Well, it's somewhat in the middle of the Guardians of the Galaxy because he was like a side character in that first movie but once he became the central antagonist in like infinity war and endgame yeah he was much better for like yeah i would think thanos is actually a really good answer for that uh but outside of that i'm just kind of drawing up like but yeah like um because i don't want to spoil who it is or anything or like what it's about the the, the character literally only shows up three times before then over the course of like 25 years of this manga's publication and in just the last six months of getting their backstory, I cried last week. Damn. 
I mean, but that, that, that's good. Though. Like, it's, like, you, it's good. Like, like I love when a show makes me cry because I have an emotional connection to that character. Like you so, know the okay. you, like you know the fucking writing is stellar when you actually cry when things happen to a character that you actually like. You know. Oh boy, this is yeah. Oh boy, this. But yeah, this boss time, sucks, dick. By uh, the way, fashion time never emotionally reacted like that to media. I do Sonic superstars. Um, uh, fucking wait! How dare you? <laughs> like, don't say that to me. <laughs> I, if Fonzie can tell you this. I played an hour and I put it down. I was like, I can't finish. That's this. fair. That's fair. You have way more fucking like self control than I do, and you're much better for it. Self control or self respect? Self control and self respect. I think the two go hand in hand in the case of Sonic Superstars. If we're being real. Yeah. Anyway, so this is the Egg Wyvern. This is the final boss of Sonic's campaign, and uh, it's no Egg Viper from so SA1. It's a it's a it's a big waiting game because all you're doing is waiting for uh, Eggman to like destroy the scaffolding, and then you have to like wait for him to dive. The only opportunity to attack him is when he dives towards Sonic. You just homing attack the uh, the little the glowing dick on his nose. Uh, if I bored? if I had the just... white gem, you could cheese this boss. It's pretty easy to do. Because for some reason or another, when you use so the white gem in this game gives Sonic a different kind of homing attack. I'm not entirely sure what the thing is that, that it does, but for some reason or another, the white gem homing attack makes Eggman react in strange ways where you can hit him, but he won't act as if you hit him, but his health will still deplete. So you can just spam the white gem over and over again and you instantly kill the boss. And if you're bored, you can just use the purple gem and go out of bounds to where the game ends. The um, stage. yeah, yeah. So like the 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 load zone for where the boss ends, I think is like right underneath the the ship itself. It's like um, all the way on the deck near yeah near the bridge. So if you There's use the collision there. if you use the purple gem to take Sonic to that area, the fight immediately ends. Well, it doesn't because end. It's just this actual collision there because it's needed for the um, results. That's funny as shit. Like we can show that off later, like when we're doing post metal cleanup. Uh, but it's like, man, like it's I, I can't even like say like like what what incompetence because that shit's entertaining. Like I get entertainment from that sort of thing, and I wanted to ask you guys that sort of too because like I know there's there's incompetence that we that we get angry at devs for, but it's like why is it fucking like this? But what kind of incompetence do you justify because you still get entertainment from like, you, like you're generally getting a heartfelt laugh because this is so fucking bad to the point where it's funny. Definitely not Sonic Shuffle. I mean, yeah, <laughs> yeah, no Sonic Shuffle is just a void of nothingness. I got there's I swear to God, I'm, I feel spoiled for choice. I can't the think of the go? name. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Go ahead, Matt. Go ahead. Go ahead. Forget it. It's like I'm spoiled for choice. There's too many examples I could probably think of over my 30 year, 30 plus years of gaming. I can't pick one out at the moment, but there's been too many where it's like, this is fucking terrible. Oh, you know <laughs> what? You know what? Not gaming example, Riverdale. The uh, CW show? Right, right, right. It is 31 flavors of batshit insane and awful, but god damn, I'm there every fucking week seeing how much work we can get. <laughs> yeah. That, and to be perfectly fair, Camilla Mendez could read a fucking ice cream label on that bitchy attitude of hers, and I'll be there all fucking ears. Here's the thing, though, Matt. So, in that case, because you tune in to every episode, can you even call it bad at that point? Oh, it's fucking terrible. Okay, all right. Like, some like... shit is just, no, believe you me, like, there is something, you know what, you can also see all the way through to the end of fucking car crash, but fuck it all, you gotta see the firemen come out, you gotta see the remains of the corpses, you gotta see the, you gotta get the news people there, getting the last people, getting the survivors, it takes like, sir, sir, you're completely fucked, any comment? And watch the tears slow down their eyes, you gotta see the whole fucking thing from beginning to end it awful, and then it's just like, and it's just magical sometimes in a dark way not the car crash riverdale let's go back to riverdale now <laughs> you, have to, you have to assess that for legal reasons it's like not the car crash it's tragic <laughs> well unless it was elon like yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. With autopilot is in his fucking n64 truck <laughs> yeah <laughs> it's fucking low poly death <laughs> <trend>. <laughs> 
I'm yeah, so, that was, by that's the a way, non-video like, game example I had. I, I, I generally want to write, I, I, right now, I want to apologize to anyone who was, like, expecting, like, just another 06 playthrough, like, for some coming Johnny, and it's like, this motherfucker is lollygagging <laughs> over the simplest <laughs> shit, and we're not even at the golden metal hunting part yet. We're just, this is just a regular fucking playthrough. Uh, and it's like, I am so sorry. Uh, but at the same time, this game has been beaten to death through so many fucking uh, different creators and let's players, speedrunners, that sort of thing where it's like, I'm willing to do anything just to make it somewhat interesting, if not for the live stream experience, then at least something to make you laugh for the archive when this goes up on the, the archive channel. But eventually, you know, it always comes back to being the dead horse. Yeah, as, Yahtzee yeah. once, as Yahtzee once said, Doric, when he was making a comparison on a vi video, Yelling at this game for being badly made it would be childish and pedantic, so let's keep doing it. Yeah. <laughs> I like how on my 360, this version gave me absolutely nothing but shit with constant crashing, and then it's like, you know what, what if I just convert it to God? Oh, that fixed it. <laughs> you converted it to... <laughs> the power of Christ, the power of crystal Pepsi compels you. I was you, like, it's not, even, it's, not even, it's not even being converted to Catholicism or Christianity. <laughs> You convert it to God. <laughs> like, that's it. Like, it's just wholesale. <laughs> the whole package deal. I just thought of that fucking Tumblr image again, dude. Text Which one? Experiment. All right. It makes, it's kind of a weird thing. It's like somebody had the weird. It was another Sonic fan art, but they basically drew Vector uh, Knuckles holding a chow while Vector baptizes it with Crystal Pepsi. <laughs> and the caption right Wait, there's a, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> and there's a caption and there's a caption right underneath it and it's just the person asking, Why is it always Sonic the Hedgehog? <laughs> what does this franchise do to people? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well Eggman enjoyed that too. Uh, it seems like I think Eggman does strike me as a Tumblr sexy man. No. You don't think so? Yeah. No. No. To, 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 chub, to Chubby Chasers, he could pull something <laughs> off. <laughs> you think this Eggman's a... Ch you think Chubby Chasers would fuck Eggman from 06, though? Yes. I don't yes. know. I don't think he's chubby enough. Like, no, he's got, no, he's got Tump. So like, yeah, he's he, got yeah, he's got a bit of a round gut, but the, it, it's kind of jarring compared to everything else because it, it worked when the style was exaggerated, like in uh, Adventure One and Two and Heroes, uh, and I guess Shadow by Proxy. But O Six, they gave him more realistic proportions, but his gut is still just a ball, uh, and I don't think it works well enough. No, it does for Chubby Chasers. That shit'll get that shit'll get him off as long as they got fat on him. They don't care. Which makes me angry. Which makes me angry because it's like, where the fuck are you when I'm around? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, technically, if you want to get down to it, uh, wouldn't that mean that like he's got a bara bod? Bar no, he does not have a bara bod. He does not have a bara bod. He absolutely does not have a bara bod. I refuse to believe that Eggman would ever be in any sort of bara community. Yeah, that would be uh, that would be Tears of the Kingdom Ganondorf there. Yeah, absolutely. Like Tears of the Kingdom Ganondorf is bara. Not yeah, Eggman well, no, from Tears 06. Of Gandorf, but he has like a uh, fucking beer keg. Yeah. <laughs> Egg Eggman reminds me of like a high school substitute teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Who doesn't bring in the television on the TV stand. So it's like he's not even the good kind of substitute teacher. <laughs> Fuck this guy. Oh, that's new. What? What? Um, you know, like the stop signs and stuff around the city, right? Yeah. What about it? Uh, you can use that to bypass the uh, the barrier to get to Eggman's base <laughs> instead of using boxes. <laughs> <laughs> you just lay it down against the wall and run against it, and it lets you clip through the wall. <laughs> Making the point is this game. <laughs> Making the point of a stop sign absolutely ironic. <laughs> Jason, I thought you were like talking about stealing an actual stop sign. <laughs> <laughs> Stop! Pick me! Yoink! <laughs> uh. I love I love this fucking death scene here because it looks like he comes apart like a fucking Lego bit. Like it, it looks like it just popped out like a Lego figure. Um, <laughs> isn't is isn't there like a glitch where it's like he's sitting down while he's doing yeah, the it's animation? Like, so there, yeah. So I, I it might be a Mandela effect. 
because it was so long ago. But I have a memory, a vivid memory, where Eggman did not even have his hands behind his head in an exasperated motion of defeat. He was still just chilling on his couch like this and just spinning out of control as he went downwards. And then with the dink and everything. But it hasn't happened again since I've mentioned it. So I'm thinking, did it even happen at all? And I hate getting gaslit like that because that's how people start getting into that fucking Matrix mentality, man. Like, I don't want 06 to blue pill me. <laughs> like, I, I would I would eat the red pill when it comes to 06. Double medals. Hey! I just remembered that I just got two uh, medals for that one. Oh, yeah, my God. You were going for nice. S. Try going for S. Like a snake. As, <laughs> like, you know, what the fuck? Like, it's, it's a poisonous cobra. Hmm. Two gold doubloons! <laughs> Plastic! Honestly, when I first saw this cutscene, I did this when I was like 12. I thought this was the coolest shit ever. I mean, to be fair, <laughs> it is a cool CGI cutscene. Yeah. You know, there was a part of me that wished there was an alternate ending. Like, cause you like, so, cause like, Sonic's gonna do a Sonic thing, right? He's got the princess on his arm. He's gonna jump across all the, 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 the broken debris of the egg carrier to make his way to the cliffside to safety. Yeah. But there was a part of me that wished there was an alternate ending where he didn't make this jump right here and he just falls to his death. No, I want an alternate ending where like he's holding um, Elise's like head down to like protect her. Yeah. And so you can't see her face or anything. Yeah. And then once they get up here, it's just she's dead <laughs> because the the part where you did the jump, her neck snapped. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, see, man, this is why down. this is why oh, like the, the, this is why when the Flash tells you he's got to rescue you, it's like you know you, I, I can only move you for like a like a, a fraction because if I move too fast, you're gonna throw up, or I'm gonna break your fucking neck. Shadow, <laughs> man, I forget who cares about it more, Shadow or Silver, but they're like, oh my god, did she cry? No. Yeah. Good. Good. Nice, Mission accomplished. So like the death of Glenn Stacy. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. I also like the end of this with the plane coming in and crashing. <laughs> You're talking about the FTCR playthrough. Yeah, the FT, FTC, uh, the final computer room playthrough has absolutely fucking ruined this thing for the rest of my life because I just hear a jet engine coming down and just crashing. <laughs> 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 That's a great edit, though. <laughs> uh, so here's the thing, though. I actually have to mute this audio because this audio does get copyright claim. So this is the, f I think it's like the, who the fuck Akon, sings this song right go. now? Akon. It's yeah, Akon. Akon. It's Akon uh, with the Dreams Come True rendition of the Sonic 2 credits theme. Uh, and this does get flagged by Akon or the music producers who's in charge of that. So uh, I can't risk that. So I'm going to mute the audio right now. And I need I need some more music uh, to uh, help fill the gap. So I'm going to I'm going to play this right now. And that oh. should be fine. Hey, X Life 67. I appreciate that. Thank you for the raid party of one Isn't, what this <laughs> claim to yeah you're right <laughs> fuck man i can't fucking win <laughs> no, no. try the uh great mighty poo opera from no uh, i don't have that on my soundboard i don't have it readily uh, available i have i think it's time. no that no that's that's fucking time for pizza dude i don't have that uh wait wait what else do i have i have a uh, friend but no no that's that's clark uh one second the other thing yeah there we no that gets copyright claim too uh there we go Soundboard is a Spider fucking Man. liability, dude. Yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> fucking. Do I even have anything Sonic related on here? Play Steamboat Willie. You're right. <laughs> that, that won't. That, that's in the public <laughs> domain right now. You're absolutely right. I can. I can do that legally, with it, and I won't get flagged for it. Uh, but was the Steamboat Willie a silent cartoon now? Yes. Yeah, well, I can. I can play it over the screen though. Oh. Uh, and and I won't uh, and, I, and I won't get uh, claimed for it. Yeah, new world. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, pack your bags, kids. We're going to Disneyland. I can do that. I live pretty close to it. <laughs> well, what about mommy? Disneyland. <laughs> <laughs> Darkest sketch. Darkest sketch. Darkest sketch. sketch. <laughs> Darkest sketch. <laughs> One brain cell dedicated to chaos. Yeah, man. All right. Uh, so 
yeah, that's it, folks. That's the end of the Sonic playthrough in terms of just getting to the end because we haven't even begun. Oh, there's so this playthrough is going to last for fucking ever, dude, because uh, oh, well. we have to we have to revisit essentially a lot of stages because not only do. So here's the thing. Every stage that we that I think in this game has five gold medals, if I'm not mistaken. We can check and look at the we'll take a look at the checklist after the credits wrap up because I don't think we can skip these credits. Oh, we can skip these credits. Never mind. Never mind. We can skip, we can skip Wait, these can credits. We? What, the, what the fuck am I doing? Dude? Oh, thank God. Um, we can skip these credits. Oh, my God. <laughs> I can't see your screen, dude. Hold on. I'm getting a sense of deja vu here. Did I just get <laughs> raided twice by x 67 <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. You didn't see it the first time. Yeah, you didn't, I was going to see it. You didn't acknowledge, <laughs> didn't acknowledge me. I got all right again. Uh, anyway, um, let me let me see the gold medal results. So every every stage in this game has five gold medals. There is one for completing the stage. There's one for S ranking the stage. There's one for collecting all the silver medals in the stage. There's one for collect the completing the hard mode of the stage. And there's one for S ranking the hard mode of the stage. Am I missing anything? I think that's what it is. Uh, we have a lot of work to do, uh, as you can see. Uh, and we are nowhere near done this game yet. But at the same time, that was the case for SA1 and SA2. Because you know, there was 180 M's to collect an SA2, especially. SA1 at least only had 130. But we're in this for the long run, ladies and gentlemen. And if this session was anything to go... I mean, I'm not going to make every session a drunk session because that shit is just going to get exhausted and my liver is going to fucking hate me. You, like, plus, that's a lot of empty calories. That's a lot of empty calories. You're absolutely right. And I'm trying to get back on a routine. And what I did tonight just fucked all that up. But it's yeah, worth it. Yeah, same on my case. Like, <laughs> but it's worth it gotta do it for the content and that sort of shit i'm gonna have the biggest fucking headache tomorrow morning uh but so it's, be it's better than I, puking in a laundry sink <laughs> i couldn't help i couldn't help but when you said that sonic adventure 1 had 130 emblems positively compared to sonic adventure 2's 180 emblems negatively you sounded like a one you sounded like an asian parent praising one kid while shaming the other that's racist matt Dude, uh, Lee told me that shit. Lee told me that shit happened to Mark. Oh, no, it's okay. Yeah, I, have, I have an Asian friend. It's fine. <laughs> anyway, we're going to call it a wrap here uh, for the Sonic Go Six Sonic playthrough. We were going to reconvene next Saturday. We're going to actually. Hold on, let me leave it up to you guys. I know that's kind of like dangerous, but uh, let, well, I'm going to leave it up to you guys. Um, can I fucking start a poll? God damn! Like, hold on a second. Hedgy the Hedgy or Pothead the Porcupine. Uh, Shadow Silver. There we go. All right, we're going to start a poll. Only going to give a minute for this one. Uh, as you guys are voting for that one, I'm going to plug the art contest. That's a part of the live stream series. So as before with the Sonic Adventure 1, 2, Heroes, and Shadow the Hedgehog playthrough, there is an art contest tied to this. Hold on, I don't have my fucking music uh, ready for this one. That is not the thing I wanted to play. No, that's the mystery music. Yeah, you know, really? actually, hold on, I actually play. There we go. There's an art contest attached to this. Uh, and the same rule applies beforehand. It must be based on the playthrough. So there's a particular moment that you really enjoy for this one. Take that moment, put it in an artistic form, and you're fine. You this must. Music is so fucking weak. You must have PayPal for a cash prize. This is non negotiable. If you don't got a PayPal, next. If not, then I can at least give you a gift card for a game system, but that's it. I don't do any, I don't do cash prizes outside of anything other than PayPal. 2D, 3D, handcrafted, it doesn't matter as long as it's yours. I accept it. Don't use AI generated images. I will know it is AI generated. It's very easy. Uh, sign your work. I won't accept it. Otherwise, send your entry to some call me johnny.business at gmail.com. The subject should re sign a ghost art contest. Best of luck, folks. Have fun with yourselves. I appreciate your time and company. What other minutes do I have here? It's like, no, that's Jeopardy. I'm sorry. <laughs> that's so cursed. This is Koopa Kate without the, this, but it's only the wubs. <laughs> so a chicken? Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> so the prices <laughs> for first place 150 USD, second place is 100 USD, third place is 50 USD. Best of luck, have fun, enjoy yourselves. I am so sorry <laughs> for today's stream. Uh, but we will reconvene next Saturday, uh, TBD, the time to be announced. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that pause I forgot, that it, I forgot that it pauses and then it just resets. Right. Right. I thought it ended, but no, it just pauses. Uh, but we will reconvene next Saturday, same time, same place. Have a good night, everybody. No, wait, fuck, we gotta raid someone. I uh, also want to thank uh Experiment for being Experiment, I'm so sorry, dude. <laughs> for being here. Uh Jen, Matt, Jason. Uh who else was somebody? Alinky was here earlier, but he had to hop off earlier because he had a headache. Uh that sort of shit. And uh I want to thank you guys for all being here and all that sort of shit. And thank you very much for entertaining me and just keeping me company during this. Um, who is streaming right now on my circle? Let's find out. Oh, uh, uh, Derek's online. We're going to go raid Derek. Uh, what's Derek doing? Uh, Derek's playing Nero Automata. Okay, don't tell Ryan. Uh, we're going to start the raid. Uh, and then we're Jesus going Christ, to... Um, <laughs> okay, open that wound so early. <laughs> uh, and then uh, we're going to give uh, Derek a good time. And then we're going to call it a night there. Have a good night, everyone and take care of yourselves. Wait, hold on. Is the raid actually going to start on time? Yeah, it did. <laughs>